Okay, hallo. Oh, wait a second. <lacht> hallo, people, and welcome back to Starfield. Ja, äh, what happened today? Yesterday? Okay, I actually had technical difficulties. But what the hell happened today? Well, peeps and peeps, uh, I have, well, um, I overslept. So let's continue with G Hero's journey through a magical, uh, I mean, uh, star field. And yes, the music reminds me a little bit of Studio Ghibli, but never mind. Hello, Jimmy, thank you for being here. I'm so sorry for being here earlier. Well, um, Early, basically, you are maybe even more on time than I am, but okay, whatever. <coughs> Hello and welcome back. Sorry. Yeah, I, I, I just, I really, I overslept. I thought, oh, I had some time left. Yeah, I can continue sleep, but then uh, Meow Meow jumped on bed and I was like, oh, you know what? It's check time. Holy moly, it is after 19 o'clock. Jesus Christ. Yeah, hi. Um, Let's continue. Mm. Yes, we have problems with um, uh, having too much stuff and too less weight capacity, carry capacity. Uh, I thought about maybe using the console, if there is a console, and like in Fallout 4, just give myself 10,000 weight, carry weight. But then I thought, yeah, you know what, you already spent a, a, a skill point into uh, weight lifting. Got plus 10,000 extra kilograms of 50, I don't know. Come on, don't do that. Not now, not this game. <clears throat> so yeah, here we are. All planets and moons have common inorganic resources. In Fallout 4, I went for intelligence. Uh, as a special... Uh, Attribute, uh, because intelligence uh, gives you more experience, but here in Starfield you cannot do that. Yeah, and you know what? Um, because of uh, loading problems, you know what? Maybe it's better now. Better now. Loading problems is looking very yeah. active. Your final health will be compromised by carrying so many. I items. don't even have laser. Now I have. Okay. But yeah, okay. Whatever, just tell me, okay?
what does the game become for? Yes. Just me or does the game become smooth and OBS when I do that? Why is it without uh, upscaling? Just take.
Frame-Rate-Probleme äh, geben, sagt mir bitte Bescheid, weil ich weiß nicht, ob einfach nur bei mir OBS leckt oder ob ihr ein paar Frame-Einbrüche habt. Weil, aber wenn was ist, sagt mir bitte Bescheid, ich mache die Grafik etwas runter. Weil das Spiel hat so ein bisschen Ladeprobleme. Vor allem was Sound betrifft, was mich total überrascht. Okay, was muss ich machen? Hab. Hab. Wow. Werde ich machen. Okay, danke schön, danke schön. Äh, wohin müssen wir? Ah. Wohin? Ich muss sagen, Alpha Centauri. Narion, okay. Bitte merken. Ah. ah, okay, bitte merken. Narion. Vectera und Kriegs. Es gab noch Zeug zu. Wait a second. Star Station. Ja, wir müssen die Mission machen. Protokoll Indigo. Is it means we have to... Im Sound ist ein bisschen zu laut immer wieder. Really? Do you mean the music? Okay. Äh, welcher Sound genau? What sound exactly is a little bit too loud? vielleicht ein bisschen verschieben. Äh, weil ihr seht ja das halbe Inter das halbe HUD gar nicht. Äh, duplizieren. Äh, Starfield. Äh, bup, 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 bup. Äh, machen wir uns mal hier hin. So. Nein, das ist das. Also wenn ich wenn ich auf dem Planeten bin, weil ich habe äh, ich habe gestern gemerkt in der VOD, äh, ich bei mir ja, sei die ganze Zeit hier diese Uhr mit Sauerstoff und bla bla bla. Ja, äh, das habe ich die ganze Zeit überdeckt. Sorry about that. Kann ich irgendwie aussteigen? Ich denke ich aus. Äh okay, wie stecke ich aus dem Schiff aus? Kann ich das im Flug machen oder kann ich nur gelandet sein? Äh, Control. No, mein Ding. Yes. Locked Ground gedappt. Ah, okay. Ich kann im Flug nicht aussteigen. Mit dem ich diese Space Verkehrsordnung aber auch. Das sollte ich jetzt besser, man hört dich jetzt immer. Ah, okay, danke schön. Oh, rein, diese Kraft schon. Warte, aber. Oh. Ah. Sieht mit den 
Schokoladebalken nicht auch meine Güte. Ah, Skaff. Nein, das ist jetzt inmitten der Dings. Hier, hier muss doch in Ordnung sein. Ja! Starship Frontier, this is United Colony Security. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Nani? Habe ich Kontraband auf dem Schiff? Scan complete. No oh. contraband detected. You are cleared for landing at New Atlantis. <lacht> Stellt euch vor, ich hätte was Illegales mitgenommen, weil ich bei Schluten war. Oh Gott. Oh, daran habe ich nicht gedacht. Äh, ja, was jetzt? Muss ich diese Dame wieder öffnen, ne? Ah. Oh. Das ist nur Atlantis. Okay. Ah, Science Outpost, Mining Outpost. Oh, Mining Outpost, okay. Äh, ja. Gib ihm. Oh. Das ist der End of the Colony War. An armistice was signed for bidding Mac and Xeno Weapon Technology. Oh, come on! No Mac Weaponry really or Starfield. Why are you limiting yourself? Why are you limiting us players? Come on, give us Mechas. Let us play a Hafken or Mac Warrior online in Starfield. Hey, come on, we don't have any vehicles or planets. We have to walk every time. Give us at least a car or a speeder bike, like in Star Wars, you know? And give us backpack rockets. Like the Mandalorians have. Oh, so many missed opportunities. LV, Kotika, how are you doing? Wie geht es dir denn so? Uh, 
Missions L. Aha. Besitze London Landmark und Earth. And here's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship, and you can stop by the Trade Authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. Yes, please. Does my ship need some repairs? Does it? Thousand. Do you want to buy my ships? Let's see what ships you have for sale. Where did you say I could sell things? The Trade Authority runs a vending kiosk next to my booth. It's just off to the side near the ramp. Besides that. Jemison Mercantile is your closest shop if you're looking for a bit of everything. That's further in, past the security checkpoint. Okay, where can I go? I need more crew for my ship. I would try the viewport. They'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Uh, okay, and what ramp do you mean? I'm mean, behind you is a ramp already. Uh, okay, no problem. Home ship. Yeah, I want my own ship. I want my own ship. I want. I either will buy my own ship or build my own ship or steal my own ship. You know. Uh, can I upgrade my ship? Please? Ship upgrade mode allows you. Ship upgrade mode allows you to make improvements to your ship without needing to worry about where modules should be placed. Bethesda, uh, fix your language. Some upgrades may have level or skill requirements. Multiple upgrades can be made and their cost will be added up at the end of the session. Aha. Aha. Can I upgrade the cargo load? Is at zero, for example, new modules will be placed in the center mass of the ship. Building new ship modules will cost credits and heating them will give you credits back. The ship builder will keep a running total and process the entire transaction at the end. There is a flight check that will give you warnings or more errors if your, de if your design is invalid for any reason. Does it help me the reason? Okay. Uh... Cool. 
cargo to 110, but I have 150. Cargo. Ah, this one has also cargo. Ah, 240 plus... Yes, 450, exact. Okay. Ah, so that also counts as cargo. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay, good to know. Excellent, excellent. Uh, what ship do you have for sale? I'm sure you can find something you like. Okay. I mean, at 12,000 per lot. Rambler. Okay. Fuel 50, Hull. Cargo 260 only? How much? Ach du Heilige. Oh mein Gott. Yep. So, oh. Sound looks realistic. Only 200 cargo capacity? 410, that's not better. What is that? A sponsor. What was that? Galileo. Galileo, 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 Figaro, da, 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 da. Ah, Galileo. Shield Breaker. Oh, sound serious. Alter. Oh, Alter, look at the cargo. Interesting. What do you have? You have rockets, you have... Is it a laser turret? I don't know. Is that the laser turret? Is that the cannon? I don't know. Uh... Spect. What weapons do we have? Lasers. Three lasers. One ballistic. Aha! And one missiles. Okay. So much cargo. But it's too expensive. Okay. Uh, Everything I... looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Okay, goodbye. I can assure you this unprovoked attack on a United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. For you, Bobby, that includes meeting your new foster parent. My parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Oh, uh, well, of, of course, uh, that's sure possible. <laughs> uh, we'll, ju uh, we'll just... <laughs> Helena Chambers, ID SSCOM 1327HCHA. I was the station administrator. I'll need to report to MAST ASAP for a full debrief. My treatment thus far has been entirely unacceptable. Any authority you had was forfeit the moment House Varun Zealots breached the station's perimeter oh. and you failed to initiate proper evacuation protocols. Oh, damn! Thank you for your service. We'll find you a new position commensurate with your experience. And Mr. Bosch, let me just say how honored I am to meet you. Are you a cook? By all accounts, you're the only reason anyone made it out of there alive. Well, just glad I still remembered my flight basics. It had been a while. So was shooting a gun. I read all about New Atlantis. So cool! Okay. Is it true that the Nat train goes 5,000 miles an hour? Or that citizens get special discounts? Or that the whole city celebrates when it's your birthday? Mine's June 11th, by the way. My parents took me to Aquila City last year. I kind of smell it. But I don't smell anything here. Um, no. Yes, no, and I will certainly mark June 11th on my calendar. As for Aquila mm. City, well, the air purifiers here in New Atlantis are state of the art. Air purifiers? <laughs> Aquila City? Oh, don't even get me started on those simpletons. A little unfair, don't you think? Free Star Rangers helped me out quite a bit a couple years back. Got ambushed by spacers near Narion. They assisted, no questions asked. Even help with some repairs so I could do an emergency jump home. Good people. In any event, you all must be exhausted. 
Just give me a moment to coordinate some details with security. What I May I help you? Okay. Uh, did I just set that right? You are what? all... No, just ugh, go away. Something to see. In the minor. Uh... Okay. What was the word called again for people who... Uh... Ah, poor child. Yeah, uh... Ah. Flüchtlinge, wie heißt die auf Englisch? Ja, wir sind gut bei den Frauen rüber. Ich glaube, die mag allgemein keiner. Außerdem bin ich eine Meiner, ich habe ein Laser, ich kann hier einfach... Ich kann hier einfach wie ein Stein abhauen, wenn was ist. Äh... Und Escape ist das Gott, der mit Google Help Me. Google schreitet zur Tat. Äh... Fehler bei der Übersetzung und den Hymnen. Refugees, thank you Google. Äh, uh, es wird jetzt ein anderes Stell. They are refugees from a stage, station that got attacked in a war. You will be scanned as you enter the city. Please keep it. Kann ich meinen Helden ausziehen? Ohne dass ich ersticke? Also, das war ja nicht. Ja. Guess you caught some of that, huh? The galaxy is at peace and somehow seems more dangerous than ever. Land damage gains? What? Spacers, House Varun, Crimson Fleet. Everyone trying to grab their peace. What happened to the early days, huh? When we just float through the stars and dream. Wash? Like a Bosch. Uh, some of us are still dreaming. That's humans for you. They can ruin a glass of water. I hear that. Spacers, who are they? The Varun is dead. Sometimes that's just how things are. So you have run into the Well, now, <laughs> you don't know how glad I am to hear you say that. I'm right here with you, my friend. I want a lightsaber. How can you not look up to the cosmos and just be overwhelmed by its beauty? So much possibility. So much hope. Even despite recent events. Uh, Alzheimer. You were saying something? Yeah, yeah. Who are you? Ricardo Bosch. I was the like a lead researcher on the station that got attacked. What station? It was business as usual until those House Varun crazies swarmed in, spouting their scripture, whatever it was. Even the Marines were overwhelmed. 
Honestly, I'm just lucky to have made it out of there in one piece. We all are. Now, I just want to get back to work. Wow. Who is that woman? Pesas? Okay. Really? <laughs> you must have been hiding under a moon rock your whole life if you've managed to dodge those assholes. <sighs> They're basically a bunch of space scumbags. Fly around, attack, and rob anyone they see. They're pretty disorganized and easy to fend off until they aren't. They're a different beast than the Crimson Fleet. Generally speaking, pirates want your stuff, so they can occasionally be reasoned with. Spacers, though. They tend to shoot first and ask questions never. So they are raiders, basically. Okay, how's the room? What's that? Not what, who. How to describe House Varun? Alter Junge. Well, imagine a, a bunch of colonists who set off into the stars ages ago, disappeared, and then re-emerged as a sort of religious society. Faction, or cult, What? whatever you want to call them. They believe in some sort of celestial deity called the Great Serpent. Uh, real nightmare fuel kind of stuff. About a hundred years back, they picked a fight with pretty much everyone in the settled systems. We eventually made peace, sort of. Then they just disappeared. I want to pause again, not skip. Uh, they're out there somewhere. Or so folks assume. And the ones that attacked us, they were the hardliners, for sure. You meet those guys, you run. You understand me? Goodbye. Was er gerade gesagt hat. People that went into deep space and returned religious. That is one to one uh, and religious praying to a other worldly deity. That is one to one the background law from the monolith faction in Stalker. A group of people deep into the zone and came back as a religious faction. Praying to the monolith. Then, okay. So we have basically space monoliths. This to me. Free wheel in space. Ace. May I help you? Must be nice. Not Let's... what? Uh. uh... 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 About a hundred uh... years back, they picked a the fight oh. with pretty much everyone in the settled systems. I guess your school never covered the Serpent's Crusade, huh? Yep, sounds like... They eventually made peace. Monolith. Sort of. Then they just... disappeared. They're out there, somewhere. Or so folks assume. The ones that attacked us, they were the hardliners, for sure. You meet those guys, you run. You understand me? Yeah, <laughs> it's like the sp... Alter, what is with that It's like the space monolith. We have run into the Crimson Fleet too, eh? Yep, that I have. Had to dump a load of cargo just last year. Microscopes, can you believe that? <laughs> Guess you can sell anything these days. Pirates are a tricky lot. In space, they're all about the hit and run. They jump in, steal your stuff, and get out of there fast. Keep your cool, and you can generally talk your way out of it. So long as you're not too attached to your valuables. Stumble upon them planet side though, and their trigger fingers get much itchier. Okay. Another time then. Yo, hi. Me no upload your language. I, I'm more for I've never sorry. been in a battle before. Ah. Everyone kept telling me to keep my eyes closed, but it's kind of hard to do that when you're running. At first, I thought it was ecliptic mercenaries shooting at us, but it wasn't. There's these other people yelling about serpents and stuff. Okay, that means a few psychos have a cult founded and have the galaxy and resources eingekauft, and they have the fear for them not. Ah, I don't know if they were psychos. I don't know if they were psychos. Oder geworden sind, aber ja, Leute sind im Weltall verschwunden und sind religiös zurückgekehrt. Psychos. 
Ja, ja. Ja, I guess. Uh, so getting this a tough place, kid. You've got to be brave as kid. I have ever met a kind of issue with my parents. Think of the bell. Fun fact. Ich hätte äh, als Merkmal auswählen können, dass ich Eltern hätte, zu denen ich jede Woche 2% meiner Credit sende. Nach Hause. So wird es mir das in der Äh. Ja, the Galaxy is a tough place, kid. Is that really an appropriate thing to say to a child? Anyway, How I'm fine old now. How are you? I hope my parents don't take too long getting here. Wait! Fun fact, ich bin tot. Oh. How? No child. Old, as old like him. Talks like that. No child at all. Hey, don't like your smile. Hey. Serpents? Hey. Yeah, it was like, snakes and serpents will eat you all, Rah, the stars will squeeze you, Rah, or something like that. I think they need psychiatric help. Psychos, psychos. <laughs> what does a little boy know about this? Sprichst du aber so? When it comes to ecliptic, I know everything. It's not like it's a secret. They're mercenaries. So they work for money, and it's like, for enough money, they'll do anything. I've heard a couple of SSNN stories about them. SSNN. My dad says they're horrible. Like they can pretend they're working for someone, and it's official, so they do anything they want. The Lodge is here in the city. We shouldn't keep Constellation waiting. Ach so, we have a schlechtes Wetter. Haben wir? Do we have bad weather now? Or something I don't know. Wanna see if I don't can if I cannot breathe oxygen unlimited on a planet with oxygen? What, what does why why should I walk without a helmet? I mean, what the hell? Is this evil or is this raw? Ja, 
like I said, all your problems. Okay. Will I go in? Let's test it out. YOLO! Wait. Uh, yeah. Please keep moving. Was meinst du mit Land Damage? Meine Güte, das ist Evening. Junge, ich brauche einen besseren Anzug oder so. Ich hab Something to report? Where can I sell my stuff? a strong mind and a good eye to sell art. Samson, combine well. So you are... Selling art is a bit of an art itself, you know. So you are an art dealer? Indeed, I am. I've been an art dealer for most of my life, plying my trade all across the settled systems. It's actually why I'm here in New Atlantis today. I'll be delivering a piece of art to a very particular client later. However, I don't yet have the art in my possession. Actually, would you like to pick up the artwork and bring it back to me? I am overweight. I'll reward you for your effort, of course. Because I am busy. Yes, why not with yourself? It's just my help entails. You simply need to go pick up some artwork. The exchange has already been arranged and you won't have to show any credits. It's just a matter of picking something up and bringing it back to me. There's really no need to worry. It's all very simple. Why? Why not you? Why not do it yourself? I'm... Well, I'm not very familiar with the streets of New Atlantis. I'm not from here, you see. Neither am I. I'd rather just avoid any trouble and have someone more capable to the exchange for me. Okay, why Excellent. Not? 
You'll be picking up the art from Zoe Kaminsky at the Trade Authority. <coughs> Tell her you're there for Samson Jabrell's art. She'll understand. Return the artwork to me, and you will be compensated. Okay. I didn't know the Trade Authority had its artwork. Well, of course they do. Why wouldn't they? I've heard tell that you can get some very impressive items at the Trade Authority. But for now, let's settle for the artwork that I've procured. You work around here? In a sense. My trade doesn't necessarily need me to be tied down in one location. Because of that, I travel all over the settled systems. I'm here now for an opportunity, but before this, I was in Aquila. Before that, Neon, in my line of work. I can't afford to stay in one place for very long. Can you tell me about yourself? Other than being an art dealer, there's not much to say. I grew up in Neon. And I knew I had to get out of that place somehow. I did a few odd jobs, some um, deliveries, and it eventually led me onto this path I'm on now. I never thought I'd do what I do, but I suppose life can be surprising. Okay. See you. See you. See you later, alligator. Da, da, da. Okay, you know what? Uh. I think I have a good position. I, I think I'm okay on the upper left corner. Ah, du bist ich If you don't see what you want, feel free to ask. Hi. I don't see anything here, but okay. Can I Hi there. Hi there. General Kino. Thanks for stopping in. Feel free to look around. <coughs> I can take care of transactions, and if you've got questions, just ask. Let's see what you have for sale. Nice plant you've got here. A nice place you've got here. Would be a shame. <laughs> Would be a shame if something happens to it, am I right? No, 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 no. Thanks. Sorry. It's hard work, but it all pays off in the end. And I can't take all the credit. Gerhardt, my business partner, he does so much of the work behind the scenes. If it weren't for him, I don't know where we'd be now. I'd like to see what you have for sale. Oh, please, take a look. Can I sell stuff? Yes, I can, hallelujah. Okay. Uh, Vendor sell. Ah, sell for my... Ah, okay. Uh... Yes. I just I found this gun at the end of stream last yesterday. And it does so much damage. Not even my 50 caliber rifle does so much damage. Not even uh not even the shotgun. It does only 57. And then there is this pistol out of nowhere, just literally laying around me right back. Okay, Kotika. Just laying around somewhere. And it does over 100 damage. Why? What is 43 Ultra Mac? What magic bullet is this? That not even if a, a 50 caliber can compete, you know? Hey? Eh? Okay. Uh, cutter, yes. Four cutters, please. So. Eon, one Eon, please, yes. I guess all the Grendels on the... All the Weilstroms. I'm not sure about the modified kettle, honestly. Muscle Prey, Compensator, Long Barrel. I'll keep them for now and sell them later. Milestorm. Same goes for that. Get the you can do. SQX. All but one. Uh, not the ammo specials. Is that something I do not need? Ich 
HRD. I mean, the pirate one looks actually nice, honestly. It's so gold. But honestly, I think I would rather sell it. They are very valuable. Take a look. Uh, check where I can sell it. Full price, you know. Uh, sell. Hex. Uh -huh. This one looks nice, actually. Thanks for coming in.
Würfelsbett. G. Mein Gott. Ähm. Wir setzen Problem. Äh, wer kann eigentlich Zell Wurst haben? Mein Gott. Holt haben. Okay. Äh. Although I have attempted an analysis several times, I simply cannot quantify humans' addiction to caffeine. Neither can I honestly, I don't Buddy, understand. It's I don't coffee. Like Pick one, get out of the way, and let us get on with our lives. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Sure. Excuse me. Here, Atlantis sure is shiny. I got locked at hand damage. Hi there. Hi there. Hello, Starbucks. Um, like to place an order. What's your favorite? Hi there. Order? Welcome to Terra Brew. How can I help you? Can you read my mind? How, how, do, how, how are you doing this? <laughs> ah, okay, so that's nice. Yeah. Corporate policy requires me to state that everything Terra Brew offers is my favorite. Ah. My condolences will be safe. Uh, it's safe to place an order. Certainly. Please take your time. Can I sell stuff? They only have stuff like 15. God. Okay, forget trades. Um. God. Where can I... Where can I trade more? Um, the, uh, honestly, the map is awful. Uh, the, map, the map is awful. I mean, yes, on a planet, on a random planet or moon. Yes, you have uh, stuff like that, unknown, unknown marks, but what is it? Yeah, unknown landmarks, but if you are inside the city, I wish to see where I can sell stuff. You know? I don't think okay. okay, where was, where was that one ADAC guy? Uh, the technician. Where was the technician shop? Ah, viewport. Was it that? <gasps> Wait a second, I got something for that. Good to see you again. Can I get you something? Never. Sorry, it's just my voice changer. Don't uh, die in the big city. Logan Cullen? Logan? <laughs> eh? You like living here? Anything you recommend doing in New Atlantis? Loading, loading, la la la. Loading, loading. Well, da, well. There is a huge tree in the Embassy District, across from the mass station. Trust me, it may sound dumb, but I think everyone should see it at least once when they're in the city. It's so cool. Oh, maybe I just love trees. Go touch a tree. <laughs> Do you like living here? Oh, sure. There's always tons of travel into New Atlantis, so there's no shortage of people to meet. I love talking with the new people and hearing about their journeys. Not to mention, it's also nice and safe. Unlike my brother's job. <sighs> what does your brother do? He's a marine. And if that wasn't oh. bad enough, he's stationed in Sidonia. He keeps telling me it's safe and how he loves his job. But I just worry about him so much. <laughs> All I ever hear about Sidonia is how many people get hurt in accidents there. I just pray that he'll be okay. Uh, 
Okay. It'll be okay. I hope you're right. I just have such a hard time believing that, though. But, oh my, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to dump it's all of so that onto you. Cool. It just feels it's good to get it all off my chest. Ah. Wait, what, 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 what? I have a good one. Life is treating you uh, well. Let me know if I can get you anything. I have one trait. Ah, oh, load, load faster, schneller, 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 schneller. Hey Always nice to see a new face. First time in New Atlantis. Yeah, nah, I'm not new. Nope, uh, I come here all the time. Nope. I didn't think it was that obvious. <laughs> oh boy. I didn't mean for you to take it personally. It's just something to say to customers. Break the ice. Know what I mean? That's Listen, what you just relax. Make yourself comfortable. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. That work for you, new guy? Let me know if there's anything I can get you. I forgot to vote again. Don't you dare to compete with the vibes in my stream, okay, lady? I could use a drink business seems to be booming for you. <laughs> What's what I want to yep. Spaceport traffic keeps me pretty busy. But just between you and me, I've got something in the works that'll <laughs> change everything. A new drink that'll make this place famous, galaxy-wide. What comes with Coca-Cola? I don't know. Uh, well, I have to give this a try. Yes, depends on what's in it. Well, at the moment, it's what's not in it that's an issue right now. I don't have everything for the recipe. I made a deal with the holler to bring me some small samples of an ingredient I think will make all the difference. But it never showed up. Oops. Turns out the guy I hired was also hired by a few other folks. The guy and the folks who ship... Less than legal cargo. Oh. Security got wind, and, so is and the you. whole lot was bounded. Now they're just sitting on it, taking their sweet time like they always do. It's killing me. You should go, go talk. Uh, you should go talk to security see if you can get what's yours. Sounds like the sort of thing that could drive one to drink. Ah, ha, 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 I'm so funny. And you just order some more of whatever you need. Yeah, talk with security. I submitted all the paperwork. Believe me. <coughs> It won't amount to anything, but I did it. And really, I'm not even certain this is what I need to finish the recipe. I just... I think it is. I need to get my hands on that cargo. That sounds like you need a helping hand. Maybe you should just let this go. It doesn't have an ominous tone to it. Why does it have an ominous tone to it? I mean, doing something about this won't exactly be on the straight and narrow, will it? It sure sounds like you need to help me. Okay, yeah. I really do. It's gonna keep me awake nights if I don't try. Before we say anything else, I am in no way asking you to do anything that might violate any of the many, many laws in place here in New Atlantis or the larger United Colonies. This is just one friend talking to another friend, asking if maybe that friend could possibly find a way to get her important cargo out of the impound. And if, hypothetically, that were done in a less than 100% legal way, well, that might not be the worst thing in the world. You, uh, with me on this? Excuse me, senorita. Uh, El Besesta, Le Cup of Glass, uh, Mino Por Favor, uh, Mino Hablo, uh, Espanol, uh, excuse moi, Monsieur. Uh, I'm here for you, I'll do whatever I can, I don't think this is going to What do I need? <laughs> what? Come on, no! I'm already uncomfortable with this whole thing. Don't go making jokes like that. Ah, of course it was a joke. Can you help me with this or not? <laughs> I'm here for 
you I'll do whatever I can. God, you have no idea what a relief this is. I'm obviously not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or something. I just figure what? there has to be a way to get what I need. Um, lady, do you work here? I think she's from the FBI. Oh no. And she disappeared. Very suspicious, very sus. I'm gonna figure something out. No, is it just where is that goes my hand here? Okay. Uh, do you have any information to go off? Off? I know a few things, but not much. The cargo is being held down at the spaceport, not in the security office. Still, they use the same access cards. If you had one, it'd work. How or why you would have a UC security access card is none of my business, of course. I'm sure I'm better off not knowing. Beyond that, the ship decks over there might also be able to get in. I don't know any of them, or I'd be talking to them instead of you. No offense. Dude! You don't know me either, and you are talking to me. That makes no sense, woman. Yeah! Okay. Uh... <laughs> But have you tried already? Like I said, I submitted the usual security release forms. But because my cargo is tied up with a bunch of, again, totally unrelated illegal stuff, I don't expect the forms to matter. At all. I went and talked to an officer at the office too. You, me. Sergeant, maybe? He was polite, but unhelpful. I declined to suggest that as their new slogan. New Atlanta Security. Polite, but unhelpful. Truth in advertising, eh? Eh, 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 eh? Uh, don't worry, I'll figure something out. You know what? No hostages, but that was my idea. Yeah, this is hardly a life or death situation. Some lights breaking and entering at worst, right? Uh. Got an interesting news I hear there's some sort of citizens group trying to get the old Varun embassy torn down. Up. Awesome. When I first heard about it, <laughs> I thought it was a bit extreme, but really, would you want to move into that place? Me neither. And it's I not like they're ever coming talk. back. <coughs> House for room, I mean? Well, at least not make nice and be all diplomatic. We all know how that went. Anything else? You know, I had a guy in here last week ranting that General Shao ought to send the Marines down into the well. I'm usually all for letting folks speak their mind. Most times it can't be helped after a few drinks. But that was just too much. Anybody stuck living in the well, it almost certainly isn't by choice. And things down there aren't that bad. The well? I don't I'm obviously you not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing blah, 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 and... Blah, blah, blah. I'm not worried. Blah. I'm annoyed. Wait, are you saying you I should be worried? Are you kidding no, me? No, of course not. It'll be fine. Totally fine. I, I trust you. They need to, they need to fix that, I, I think. Uh, I could use a drink. Sure thing. What can I get you? As, you wait, you know, people, as, as soon as, as, as the lady said something again about... Let's, I just political, you know, something doing like, just... If someone would do something like going in and something like stuff, yeah, I mean, I don't care. I mean, uh, what? I mean, uh, the blonde woman appears from behind the screen again. You know what? I think I'm. It is not the best position to be again. My God. Is that okay? I hope. Uh, sell. Wait, damn it. Stop by anytime you'd like to. Who get. are you? I re Oh, it's you. You you work here, okay? You don't look so Never surprised. Damage, severe, poor. Poor, it's... The fish! 
I thought it was an inhabitable planet. <laughs> That what airborne does. Is that what airborne does? See you. Right there, no. That was not the vendor I searched. I was looking for. Uh, How do I sell my stuff? Up here? Wow. No, it's not. That here may be... You hear about the job by any chance? Uh, the officer over there can help you with any bounty issues. Oh! A job? Tell me about it. Part-time security officer. The position's very flexible. Uh, you can basically work whenever you're available. No pressure. We've had some gaps in the schedule lately. Macy's out on maternity leave. Jose's on loan to Sidonia. When it rains, it pours type of situation. So really, we just need someone to fill the void. Interested? Okay, definitely just tell me what I need to do. Well, uh, first things first, <coughs> I have to ask. Do you have any security experience at all? Uh, if I don't have any feedbacks for you, Joke. Uh -huh. uh, I think if, see, okay, if I would have had a matching background like military guy or bouncer, uh, I think that would have played a role here. I, oh yeah, totally, I was head of security for the Astral Lounge on Neon for like eight years. I had a run in with the Crimson V, don't know if that counts. You know. It sure counts for something. I mean, you're alive. And resilience is definitely an important trait for any officer. Okay. Well, I think I've heard all I need. Really? Your first assignment couldn't be easier. And I Go to Mass and, and I'm check in with Agent security. Plato at Aegis. There was a package left at a dead drop and they need DC <coughs> security to handle it. He'll fill you in on the details. I get the uniform. <gasps> I get credits just by um, uh, applying? Oh! Okay, I've got a friend who needs some things from storage as a space support. Yeah, we all got friends who need things. But we've also got rules and regulations, and I'm not going to bend them. Your friend can file a request like everyone else. But she did. But must. You know, must. Uh, the Military, Administrative, and Scientific Triumvirate. Giant building in the center of the city. Headquarters of the entire United Colonies. I really should have given you a more thorough interview. Hey. hey don't deny me, I'm already hired. Mention Aegis, who are they? Aegis? 
They're basically UC intelligence. They help identify threats to New Atlantis before they become problems. While we're separate departments, there are times we need to rely on each other, so it's important to keep a good working relationship. We do Agent Plato this favor, and maybe he'll toss us some intel when an investigation stalled. Tit for tat. You know how it works. Aha. Uh -huh. Why am I bringing this package here? Not ages. Well, just because you're bringing it here doesn't mean that's where it'll end up. As for why, you can ask Aegis. As far as I'm concerned, it's none of my business. Fair enough. Let me know if you have any questions. Where can I sell stuff? God damn it, I need to find the technician guy again. At his booth. The well's been having brown eyes all the time. The mask finally sends someone down there. Well, why does my light not work? I'm wearing a helmet, am I not? Yes, I am. But nothing's changed. Ach so. Yeah, God needs to recharge the light. Of course. Right through the checkpoint. Where is the technician? Just check out the Trade Authority kiosk next to my booth. Otherwise, there's Jamison Mercantile further in. Jamison Mercantile? I went there in first. But wait, where is your booth? Just check out the Trade Authority kiosk <gasps> next to my booth. Otherwise, there's Jamison Mercantile further in. Where? Oh God! What the facial? Ah, dude. You have a communication problem. So that is your booth, yes? Can... If you... Dudes! If you... If you say... Psh, shut up! Psh. Oh, God. If you say kiosk... Can you maybe... Make that you may mean something like... Tablets, thingy, not a real kiosk where you can buy cigarettes or comics and stuff like that. My God, it was right here around the corner. Metal card is five thousand. My God, alter Schwede. Okay. Okay. Oh. 
English from ship inventory. And Cranius. Okay. Resources.
some action movies. I'm gonna see you next time. Bye. Okay, Kostika, sorry for the lack of action today. Um, and for being late. Uh, have a nice week. Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. I don't know. My flashlight doesn't work. Why does my flashlight work? Now it works. <sighs> Some of the ships we get hand in here. Like their own. You made all that up. There is no such addendum. The war ended almost 20 years ago. I am Representative Evans Chisholm of the Free Star Collective. I've been coming here for months trying to ensure continued peace. I don't make up the laws, Representative. I just enforce them. You have a good day now. Some place else. Hey, no loitering. What? Can't you see I'm, I'm dealing with something? What was that all about? The guards seem to have issues with you. Did you not hear? They won't let me enter the city. Me, a political envoy who comes here constantly trying to help prevent another war. And this is the thanks I get? They won't let me enter without a diplomatic visa? Ridiculous. Here I am biting your head off. Apologies. I'm just, well, rather flustered. Look, if you have time, could you please go to the Free Star Collective Embassy and speak to a diplomat? They'll know what to do. Hey, it's been a pleasure. My good deed for the day. Yes, I'm happy to... uh, okay. Thank you. I'll wait here until the Embassy sends the cavalry. Not like I have much choice. Next time, just bring papers, okay? My God, they. Yeah. I, as a German, must listen to this bull, bull crap. What's the word? Uh. British. Viable? No. Valid, valid. Not viable, valid. Next time, bring valid. Valid. <laughs> Next time, bring valid papers, okay? Hi. Uh, you will be scanned as you enter the city. Please keep moving. Okay. Get the skin up. Okay. No bounty. You're clear. Enjoy your Good. visit. Uh, missions. 
of Wait, um, Why can't I do multiple missions at once? Nope, the artillery. Okay. Storage well set. This really isn't a good place for civilians to be hanging around. There's something I can help you with? I sure just got some cargo that was pound and I need Yeah. I can't really just let you in there. Okay, let's play a minigame. I know you'd like to help me if I could. I know you'd like to help me if you could. Sorry, but uh, I can't. Uh, for reasons I'm just trying to help. Look, <laughs> I'd like to help, but. Of a joke, I heard the other day. For his first different problem with her. That reminds me of a joke I heard the other day. <laughs> That's a good one. There's no reason for us to have a problem, is there? <sighs> I'm glad you understand the position I'm in here. Alright, look, don't tell anyone I did this for you. I could lose my job over it. If anyone asks, I had nothing to do with this. You got it? Thank you. One second. Alright, make it quick, will you? Try and be careful, okay? Don't want a ship landing on your head. If anyone asks, I didn't do anything. Thank you. Desperate, but any luck finding my cargo? Hey there, new guy. Hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. Can we just talk? Finally, okay. I have a present for you. 
Oh, no way. You really got it? I probably don't want to know what you did to get this, right? I mean, I want to know, but it's maybe better if I don't. Well, no one died getting this. But in the fair, I never met. Really, no one died getting this. I certainly hope not. This is a huge deal to me, but it's not worth either of us murdering over. Well, look, I can assure <laughs> this will all be worth it in the end. Matter of fact, I'm going to let you have the first ever sample. On top of that, you get free uh, drinks. Not not like unlimited free oh. drinks. But you want a little pick-me-up now and then? I got you covered. I need some time to work on what comes next. But this... This was the difficult part, I think. Really? Thank you so much. Wow! Supernova? 2,000 credits? Forget trading, just let's do missions. Wow! And am I now your experimental bunny or something? I mean, okay, Supernova. See you around. Sounds like a bomb policy. Anything I can do for you? Oh. Ah, oh, level 4! Still put the vendor Okay. Wait. Let's see me something else. Astronomy. I don't know what to take. Uh, you know what? Or should I go with gastronomy? Craft Deutschland. Thank you. 
go with something like um, that an environmental condition would be very good to have. Just steal it like that. 
You ask me, the real new Atlantis is down here. It's not the top scene. It's kind of safe. What? But what is that? Is it an Egon? Okay. So reliable, but I got ways of getting things. Antonio Bianchi, what do you sell? Let's see what you've got. You see, you have a lot of surplus. Look around, you tell me. You see, it's a big organization. A lot of planets, a lot of people, a whole lot to keep track of. Sometimes they don't do such a good job of that. Sometimes stuff falls through the cracks. Winds up collecting dust in some warehouse. But that's all right. Because I, and by extension you, get to benefit. I make great deals on stuff in bulk, you get some low prices. Everyone wins. Okay. How do you like living in the well? A lot of people will tell you it's the worst. One step above being homeless. They'll whine about how folks topside have it so much better. Me? I like it. It's more real down here. Topside, everyone's trying to show how civilized and rich they are. Oh, it's exhausting. But, hey, to each their own. Okay. Let's see what you have got. Bigger time. I got all day. Now, what do you have? Weapons. Boosted Solstice. It's a weapon? A nice name. Probably there's a weapon. Okay. Long barrel 
holographic sight, focal lens 10. 1.5 kilowatt laser. Oh, okay. Good knife. That is a combat knife. Really? Cutter. Good weapon. Ion. Equinox. And the uh, Motivate Aeon. Solstice. What is that? It's light focus, also fully automatic. Aha. Side star. Okay. Uh, 13 damage, not bad. 27 caliber. Okay. Fire rate. Oh, so I thought you were like a mini Uzi or something. Specialized. Specialized high stuff. Yes. Aha. Okay, long barrel. Long. Aha. Laser side, reflex side, tactical magazine. Suppress side star. Something else, I'll be here. Okay. Oh, what is I can only steal it. Oh, I cannot buy it from the mannequin, okay. I will buy it. Oh, hello. Va? Okay, you know what? Uh, let's... Yeah, let's change the settings. It's just... Not fun! Not fun! Light lighting? No. Reflections? Oh, come, let's go. Uh, volumetric lighting.
I'm busy at the moment. For the Trackers Alliance, get yourself set up with a job from one of the mission boards in town. Not everyone's cut out for this line of work, but you'll be fine and get paid as long as you follow our motto, show no mercy, leave no quarter. Wait, what is your name again? Trackers Alliance, not Trucker. Okay, now that makes sense. Okay, point in the right direction. I want to check if there's a bounty on my head. On you? That's news to me. Although I have heard about someone paying bounty hunters to get rid of a few special targets. Let's see. Yep, it looks like that's you. My condolences. Oh. Still, that's got to be a mistake. I can clear this up for you if you're willing to part with some creds to grease the wheels. Three thousand creds ought to do it. Trade permanently. No. Oh. All Never right. Mind. Let me know if you change your mind. Okay, interesting. We have actually active in-game influence on our trade. Uh, what is the Trekkers Alliance? We are, quite simply, an alliance of bounty hunters. Some of us share resources. Some of us go it alone. But the organization makes it easier for us to do our jobs and legitimizes our work so that rather than being paid vigilantes, we are part of the system. Various people approach the Alliance looking for those living on the land. We use our unique skills to find and deal with them. Uh -huh. but, uh, good I've got one I don't mind sharing with you. There was one time I had to track down one of our own. Someone I once called friend. She'd gone rogue. We have lists of our members and their contact information kept secret for obvious reasons. This one. She had hacked into our systems and began to distribute lists to the highest bidders. You could imagine many people would kill to have this information. So I had to track her and stop her before she could make the first delivery. Let me tell you. It's not easy to hunt someone who knows all your tactics and techniques. But I found her. And when I did, I silenced her for good. Hmm. Okay, I'm looking for bounty hunting work, if you can point me in the right direction. I can, and I will. But know this, bounty hunting can be difficult work, so make sure you're prepared before you set out. If you think you have what it takes, then you can find Trackers Alliance jobs listed on mission boards, with payment delivered upon completion. I'll point you in the right direction, but after that, you're on your own. Follow the motto, and you'll be fine. Show no mercy, leave no quarter. Okay, wow. Can you tell me more about mission boards and better find them? Certainly. You'll find mission boards in every major city, and some of the smaller settlements as well. You can use them to find many types of jobs, including Trackers Alliance bounty missions. More often than not, they'll be near spaceports. Check the bars where travellers and freelancers like yourself might frequent. A word of advice. Mission boards are guaranteed payment upon completion of the job. You can rely on them, unlike some of the bar flyers who might offer sketchy jobs. Okay, good to. Go and leave no quarter. Okay. Sounds like a motto for a little thing. Apex Electronics. Ah. No lawyer. 
Can't say I'll have what you need. But you're welcome to look. Let's see what you've got for sale. Eh, ain't much. But take a look. New paste, bitch. No shit repair fundamentals. Should I buy it? I got 53,000 credits. Yay. Resources. Okay, good to know. It's killing Ah, that's how much they sell it to me. Okay. I'm surprised to find an electronic shop. Electronics shop in the well. That's so. Think folks down here are too poor to afford electronics. Not the first time I heard that line. Yeah, I get that kind of attitude far too often. You find yourself with any more commentary, feel free to keep it to yourself. I didn't mean... Yes, sorry, I didn't mean anything by it. Uh, it's fine, just maybe give things an extra thought before you let them roll right out of your mouth. Sorry. Not off my ear. Nope, no question, business has been slow lately. Oh. Not too worried, though. Managed to make ends meet for a good long while. Don't expect that to change now. Okay. Fuck ow. Okay. Take care. Love you. Don't mind me. Just a weary man resting his feet. I help out Henrik from time to time. Not very often these days. But that's fine. What do you do here? Oh. Henrik is an old friend of mine. I help out around here from time to time. But I don't just loiter around. I'm involved in my own business endeavor as well. I would like to do business with you. Unfortunately, I'm quite old-fashioned. I only deal with associates that I know and trust. But if you do a small favor for me, I might feel comfortable opening my business up to you. All what you need to do is pick up a package from Red Mile and deliver it to me. You don't even need to interact with anyone. Uh, this seems, seems shady. What? You, yeah, yeah. Oh God, thank you, people of writing text in Bethesda. What even is your business? Ah. Uh, I'm not at liberty to discuss that yet, but I assure you, it's quite lucrative. Uh, what's in the package? The contents are of no interest to you, and they're not contraband if that's what you're wondering. If you're uncomfortable doing this favor, you're free to decline. Okay. Well, I'll do it. Fantastic. I eagerly await your return. So day in here, isn't it? Maybe a little, but that's not such a bad thing, is it? Better than all the noise and attention topside, if you ask me. Stay out of trouble. You have a workbench. Does someone offer services with weapon workbenches? Hey, what else do we have here? God, is it blurry? God, is it blurry? What do you do? Huh? Kai's house. Always nice to see a fresh face around. Hey, please. You stop in whenever you'd like. Do you know why this place has stood for so long? I make sure everyone's comfy. I tell it like it is, and I don't take any shit. Stay as long as you like, and don't be a stranger. Hey, Shepard's pie. Oh, wow. Evan style shepherd's pie with braised meat and roast vegetables and the mashed potatoes. Oh. Everyone's welcome, so long as you keep your hands to yourself. Understand? 
No causing trouble in here. Okay, tell us some mason. No I shortage saw it. of hungry mouths to feed around here. Keeps us on our toes. Nothing else. Oh, I look like and it damage. My English is bad lately. Angestellter. Stelter. Employee. Of course. My God. Uh, oops. Uh, you don't look like an employee. I thought you were a customer. Yeah, you're welcome to some of whatever we've got cooking today. Mom, that's Kay, gets all the credit. Huh. Started making sure people felt welcome back when I was just a kid. She had one rule, no causing trouble. Everyone abided by it, put their differences aside when they came through the door. After a few years of feeding so many mouths, we needed extra credits to stay afloat. Didn't mean for this to turn into a business, but here we are. If folks are willing to pay a little to have some place to feel safe and get a decent meal, well then we'll sure take it. Serving food all those years ago. Hey there. What the fish? Are you a woman? Okay. I thought you were a man. I'm so sorry. What else do we have? That. That is information. Ah. Welcome to New Atlantis. Okay. Why is that not in the starport? Hello, welcome to the city of New Atlantis, capital of the United Colonies and for many the federal systems as a whole. You stand now in the most technologically advanced city the human race has ever conceived and constructed. New Atlantis was founded in the year 2156, same year we first arrived in the Alpha Centauri star system. If you are a resident, then you are... Ah! Ow! Ow! Hi! Why do you always have to grab my ass with your claws? Oh, yeah, just feel comfortable. Feel dich willkommen here. 
Oh. Oh, you are English. Ah, you have beautiful claws. You are so fierceful and your feet are so... <laughs> you have so soft beats. Oh. If you want, I can uh, place a... Uh, I can place a blanket here. You know what? Let me do that. It was just dangerous, wait. Uh, I'll be back, people, in a second, okay? Uh, I'll be back. If you are a resident, then you are already familiar with your fantastic home. And if you are a visitor, you are an honored guest of the United Colonies and will be treated as such. Our cultural and professional security personnel can be found all over the city and it's their job to ensure your time in your Atlantis is joyful, lawful and productive. Oh. So as you stroll the streets or take the NAT train to the city's different districts, Know that you are in the employees of the United Colonies and couldn't be in better hands. Our shared history. We are the children of Earth. The United Colonies as an entity was first established in the year 2159 on the planet Earth as a means of unifying the human race as we spread amongst the stars. Our goal was
was a peaceful exploration and colonization of space working in harmony with anyone who wished to sail horse across the blackest sea, the New Horizons. In 2161, we issued the Centaurus Proclamation, which formalized the colonization of distant worlds for anyone who wished to do so. Unfortunately, not everyone shared in our dream. When wars erupted across the settled systems, the United Colonies stood steadfast, protecting humans and the right to fairly colonize. And then, when our beloved homeworld was rendered uninhabitable in the year 2200, three, only 50 years after? Wow. The United Colonies knew it had a sacred responsibility. We were to be the keepers of Earth, its artifacts, its ideals, its cultures, its very people. So why... Oh! Earth is not inhabited again? Uh, inhabited now? Okay, so why do you stand now on the planet Jameson, in the city of New Atlantis, in the Alpha Centauri star system? Know that for all intents and purposes, you are still very much on Earth, and Earth takes care of its own. What happened to Earth? Corporate Directory. Here in New Atlantis, a citizen or visitor can find just about any service they may need, from freshly brewed coffee to completely body reconstruction. We have it all. Complete body reconstruction. What the fish? Okay. The following is a list of corporations and businesses that have found a home in New Atlantis. This direct location is indicated in parentheses. Uh, Terrapo Coffee, Spaceport, Commercial, Jameson Mercantile, Spaceport, The Viewport Tavern, Spaceport, Centurion Arsenal, Residential, Reliant Medical, Residential, Enhance, Commercial, Chunks, Residential, CG's, Residential, Eight, eight, close here, residential, outline, commercial, Jake's, the well, Apex Electronics, the well. Okay. Other buildings and services. Here in New Atlantis you will find a wide variety of buildings that provide various functions and services. They include Gull Bank, commercial, SSNN, commercial, the Trade Authority, the well, Sanctum Universum Church must House of Enlightenment the Well Priester Collective Embassy must House Varun Embassy must okay Infinity LTD Corporate Headquarters Commercial Med Bay the Well UC Surplus the Well Oh okay Must is it possible to visit your dentist and don't notice the imposing structure that is must? Much more than a building. Must also serves as the very foundation of the United Colonies. There the military administrative and scientific triumvirate works tirelessly to ensure continuing peace and prosperity for everyone under the UC's protection. Uh, citizenship. The foundation of any society is its people and there is no stronger person than a United Colony citizen. As a citizen, you will carry a status unequaled in the settled systems and will be recognized as the truly special individual you are. Whether you make your home in New Atlantis, Caedonia, or any other officially recognized settlement, citizenship is the truest badge of loyalty and dedication to the United Colonies you can possess. As a United, Col <clears throat> as a United Colony citizen, you will be afforded the following privileges an exclusive and personalized acknowledgement of your new status. Okay, a welcome letter signed by none other than President Alexandra Abello herself. Wow, how, how long, how many letters does she, does she sign? Every time. And, and how, and how often? This counts at all major United Colonies business establishments. Exclusive access to home ownership in Atlantis. A one-time credit disbursement. And more. Is that what I think it is? Disbursement? Wait. Disbursement. Oh. Ach so, nur 
wait, credits, not loan. Oh. Oh, okay. Never mind. Oops. How does anyone be uh, how does one become a citizen? It's easy. Simply serve the United Colonies in any official capacity, and once you have met the allotted requirements, citizenship will be granted. Wait, service guarantees citizenship. Wasn't that the wasn't that the slogan in uh yeah is a uh, space troopers or something? Like the is it new games that came out? Where you have to fight off bugs and you can build a base with your team and stuff like that, you know? I am doing my part. Ah ha 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 ha. You know, stuff like that. Uh currently the fastest and simplest way to achieve citizenship is to complete a tour of duty in the Vanguard. The United Colonies very own volunteer fleet. So if you you have got your own ship in the Moxie to you need your own ship. Wow. As a moxie to put yourself in harm's way for the good of the UFC, speak with Commander John Tuala and Must and get signed up today. Note that as of this time, the United Colonies offer citizenship to anyone within the settled systems, regardless of current address or faction affiliation. If you want the United Colonies, the United Colonies wants you. Doesn't sound so bad. Okay. Ah, Pschuplik, Schuppa. Okay, let's push it. It's my working attire. Uh, yeah. Seems like the Crimson Fleet is everywhere these days, spreading like a virus through the settled systems. They like to set up shop in old facilities, places abandoned in the colony war. That way, they can strike anywhere. My mother wanted me to be a doctor. A doctor. <laughs> Mothers, am I right? <laughs> Woman. <laughs> if there's something you need, no matter what it is, either I have it or I can get it. Dwayne Kaminsky, hello. Trade Authority. Welcome to the Trade Authority. If you're here on legitimate business, I would be more than happy to help you. If, however, you are here <sighs> under false pretense, say, sent by one Miss Tsang of UC Distribution, then I'm afraid you'll find nothing illegitimate here to report to her. And I'd ask that you pass along my request to stop these silly games. So, what'll it be? That's a strange way to introduce yourself. Closest you have blown my cover. <laughs> Perhaps, but I'm quite confident in my business, and I refuse to be intimidated. Please, let me know if I can assist you further. Oh. I'd like to see what you have for sale. I'm interested in doing. You know what? Yeah, let's go. Of course, of course. What do you sell? What you fight Ark Welder? What is it? Heavy. Are you a. F Wait. Are you really just a welder or are you. Mag 100? Laser sight position tuning. Are you a flamethrower or are you like a. Well. Welder. I think it's a welder. Okay. Eon, automatic Equinox, or battery, or automatic. What you fight old earth hunting oh. Chicky bricky, chicky bricky, chicky bricky, chicky bricky, chicky bricky, Old Earth hunting rifle. Oh, okay. What if I did that? Oh, wow. Ich 
Dangerously addictive and trauma to have been developed by Crimson Fleet. By the Crimson Fleet. Oh. With 20% damage for 2 minutes, plus 20% movement speed for 2 minutes. Synthetic Fire Spell. Okay. Let's The name made it rather obvious. We are the authority on trade in the settled systems. Whether it's bulk cargo, specialty items, or individual requests, we make sure things get where they need to go. We have shipping lanes across the settled systems and deal with nearly every major corporation and faction there is. But, uh, uh, why are you way down here in the well? We've been in New Atlantis for a very long time, before most things topside were built. With lots of infrastructure already in place, ample storage, and discreet access to the spaceport, it makes sense to stay. It's had the unintentional, but not unwelcome, side effect of weeding out people who can be... timid about doing business. Okay. Uh, I'm here for some art tips to prepare the but you know what? I'm doing, I'm interested in doing work for the trade authority. Well, that depends. If you have a ship and are willing to haul cargo, then we've got some work. Otherwise, you're gonna have to be more specific. We frequently post cargo running jobs up on the mission boards around town. Check them out. I've heard our jobs pay well, and on the off chance that's not what you're looking for, well, I can't really help you then. So you have been... If this is some sort of bargaining tactic, I assure you, it won't work. Uh, so they are something like the, the traders in Sea of Seas. I see. What about mission boards and where to find them? Many different parties use the mission board to post jobs for freelancers and the like. For example, the Trade Authority uses them to post cargo hauling jobs. You'll usually find mission boards and bars, typically ones nearest the spaceport. You might be able to find them elsewhere, but that's your best bet. I am not done with you, lady. I'm here for some art, Thompson. Thing about uh, the trade business? Who you know? Ah, uh, yes, I've been expecting you. Here's your package. Huh? And don't worry, I've already corrected the ownership record for you. Okay. Oh, I, uh, what's that supposed to mean? 
Nothing. Nothing at all. Thanks for your business. If you need anything else, you know where to find us. Shady. If something happens, I will sell you out. Hmm. Here do we have more missions to do down here. Ah, it loads so much faster now. Asian Plateau, uh, anything else here? Activities. Uh, one mission talk to an embassy to the see brownouts in the well, or the brownouts. Oh, my affliction has been, is cured. Okay. I shouldn't assume. Maybe you go by Garl. You're just not the Garl I was waiting for. We're supposed to be investigating a power drain down here. People have been reporting brownouts for a while, and Mass finally decided to follow up on it. I can't be in two places at once, and Garl isn't here. So I'm just trying to look inconspicuous. I could assist you. What exactly are you investigating? Who's Garl? A co-worker of mine on this assignment with me, clearly not taking it seriously. Not really surprising. Most folks are fine with ignoring what goes on down here. What is it that you investigating? We're trying to isolate a power drain, which looks like it's the result of a large amount of power being rerouted through various subsystems. But it's kind of a two-person job. Someone needs to find the junction boxes associated with those subsystems and power them down. The other person needs to monitor the system remotely. It's pretty simple, really, and relatively safe. Only a small chance of electrocution. I could assist you. Well, since you're here and Carl isn't, and I really want to get this solved, I will take you up on that. What I need is very technical. I can talk you through it remotely. I'm gonna head to the monitoring station. The first box we're looking for is over near UC Surplus. You know, Antonio's place. Hello? I can contact you once you get there. In reality, something like that would have never happened. I mean, you wouldn't just get a job just like that, just because someone else did not show up. No, you would be asked for, I, I guess, uh, something like maybe background a little bit or anything. You, you would be at maximum inter minimum interview. If you are even competent and uh, uh, made for this job, you know. Uh, wait, where do I go now? It's good. Look at the junction box. Yeah, I swear to God, if I end up on some far off. Just on Can you hear me? I think this is working. I only have a general view of things, but you should be near the first junction box. Look for it mounted on the wall. When you find it, open it up and flip the big switch. Ah, 
you're talking with me, I did not consent to this. That's it. Great job. So, that tripped the secondary breaker, and that goes to... Oh, wow, really? They wired it like that? Jeez, okay. Okay, got it. Next one is way down past Jake's. And maybe up a story or two? It's a bit of a hike. Sorry. Uh, not a problem. It actually kind of shows me around. Let to go and stuff like that. Uh... to join a crew. Any openings? Oh. I'm interested. How much will it cost? Outpost engineering. Trust me, you'd be getting a bargain. How much? 30,500. What? I don't think I should pay you that much. I'm just gonna tap out. Okay. Admission board. Ah. Well, I you legally are. required to remind you that management is responsible on account of something bad happening to you in here. Okay. You buying? You want a beer? Fine. 
you want a buddy to talk to or a therapy session or whatever, walk right back out that door. Uh, you got a lot of business down here? Down here? Like that's somehow different from other bars? Wars, maybe? That's what we're implying? What is with those people and always getting, like, insulted? Oh, I just making conversation. It's really underground, so I wasn't wrong. Yeah, well, don't. Down here. What are you? Me. A structural engineer? Some mast egg head? I know full well what down here implies. Your problem. Nice place you've got here. First of all, I didn't ask what you thought of it. Second, don't blow smoke up my ass. We both know it ain't nice. The fish is wrong with you. I got a gun. Shut up. No, well, I don't bye. even want to look at what you have. Right?
Good. Let's continue. After I unmuted OBS, haha. Well, you got it. Really well done. You saved me like a week of work. Why didn't you meet me at the monitoring station near where we met? Okay. <laughs> I locked him like a cat. Oh. Okay. Uh, good. Am I even holding this scanner? Valuable on you. Keep it close. <laughs> Never know what might happen down here. Who are you? I don't like your idiot. Mess with me and I'll serve you my famous knuckle sandwich. <laughs> Scared, aren't ya? Yeah, well news flash, buddy. I don't like anything about you either. In fact, I dislike you with such conviction that I'm inclined to fight you right now. What do you say we go ten rounds? Right here, right now. You aren't worth the effort. Ha! Oh, I knew you were a coward the moment I laid eyes on you. A word of advice. Down here, you need to be big, strong, and cunning to survive. Like me. Cunning. A pipsqueak like you won't last a day. Oh, thank God, I was sick. Hearing your voice. I'm not gonna be stuck in this place for long. All I know is. Just finish it. Stop! In the name of the law! <laughs> Catch me, Batman! I've got limited An interesting background sound design. Strong and cunning to survive. Like me, you would such conviction that I'm inclined to fight you right now. What do you say we go ten rounds? Right here, right now. You aren't worth the effort. Oh, I knew you were a coward the moment I laid eyes on you. A word of advice. Down here, you need to be big, strong, and cunning to survive. Like me. Cunning. A pipsqueak like you won't last a day. Oh, thank God, I was sick. I'm hearing your voice. I'm not gonna be stuck in this place for long. All I know is... Just... Finish it. Stop! In the name of the law! You with such conviction that I'm inclined to fight you right now. What do you say we go ten rounds? Right here, right now. Right here, right now. Uh, 
Uh, what, what's his name? Rick? In this place for long. Rick. Don't be like Rick. Okay. What do you mean an error occurred? You aren't worth the effort. <laughs> Catch me, bad man! I've got limited resources. <laughs> you aren't worth the effort. Okay. Don't oh, be like... I knew you were a coward the moment I laid eyes on you. Uh... Oops. Stop right there! You see security! Damn it, I wanted to loot him. So I just couldn't get it, but... Uh, I'll go quietly. Come on, take me alive! I guess you're smarter than you look. Boom! Oh, what happened? As long as he doesn't overfight my uh, save file, everything is fine. So six days in what? From murder? Oh wow, that was troll, wow. Okay, that uh, load. Uh, load? Yes. You can craft jump away in the middle of a space battle if things aren't going your way. Just remember, you may need to take energy away from some critical systems in order to power up the craft drive. Okay. Can I build a TIE fighter? Most star yards would hire me? <laughs> what am I saying? Of course they would. I'm the best. Are you a pilot? I'm working on it. Taking the UC Vanguard exams. Saving up for my own ship. You know how it works. It's just taking a little longer than I expected. Okay. I'm <laughs> I'm something of a pilot myself. Don't worry, these things take time. Pilot is hard, give up now and save yourself the embarrassment. I'm something of a pilot myself. Damn, hotshot. What are you doing down here then? This is the last place I'd be. What can you tell me about the well? You want food? Go to Case. You want an attitude? Try Jake's. Ah. You want to feel empty inside? <laughs> Get your bags and move in. Ah, seriously though, this place is half doom and all gloom. Which is precisely why I am leaving. I like the up here, don't leave. I miss, miss, miss. I like it. Where'd you grow up? A septic tank? It's about the only place worse than this dump. Okay, whatever. See ya. Bye. Where do I go again? Ah, right. Uh, is this way? Okay. Am I walking through the hospital? <gasps> oh, famous pharmaceutical lab. Oh, that's cool. Is this a hospital? It's a hospital. What am I doing here? Why can't people just walk through the hospital? It's an interesting shortcut, cut, I guess. Okay. Okay, no information. Uh, 
Ah, aqui, ó. Tá bom. Ó. Ai. Did I say thank you? Because thank you. There's no way I could have done that in a reasonable amount of time all by myself. I beat your head. So this man is good. I'll do what he's doing. Send you both got to waste our time and whatever you just did. Was happy to help. Well, not everyone would be, and I appreciate it. Thanks to your help, I was able to trace the power drain. I know where it's coming from. Unfortunately, the source is exactly where I was afraid it was. The trade authority. Oh. So that's yeah. something that I'll need to deal with. That'll be fun. If you want to tag along, I certainly wouldn't complain. But if not, then this is where we part ways. Okay, uh, uh but for you, two thousand credits? Oh, yes, please, ma'am. So thanks to you, we've got evidence that the trade authority is behind the power drain being reported down here. I don't know if you ever dealt with the trade authority, but Zoe is intimidating. I have to go in there, but I, I have really, guns really and don't want it. You think you'd be willing to go with me? Just make sure this doesn't go badly. Okay. I've got your bag. I don't know. I feel like I'm the one who's going to wind up in trouble. Zoe's got a way of twisting things. I've got your bag. Thanks. That means a lot. I can do the talking, I think. Just be ready for, well, anything. Just be ready for anything. 
I don't know if she's going to come out of there with a gun or call in mercenaries or what. I don't want this to turn out violent if we can avoid it, okay? Maybe I can... stand behind her back. I won't fire the first shot, but I will fire the last one. Yes, just relax. Everything is going to be fine. I'm going to get it off. I'm sure you're not overreacting. You know what? Uh, don't worry. I won't fire the first shot, but definitely the last one. That's dramatic, but reassuring, I guess. What is my best weapon? This one. Well, Miss Freyas, I apologize for not taking this matter more seriously. I assure you, I will eagerly assist in getting to the bottom of this. No, you're not weaseling out of this. We got to the bottom of it. You are the bottom. I appreciate your enthusiasm for your work, but I do a little more research before casting aspersions. Pardon. Someone has indeed been using this location through which to route electrical power. It is not the Trade Authority. I've had my suspicions for a while, and I've been keeping detailed notes, which I'm happy to share with you. For now, though, what do we do next? I... wait, what? Oh, for heaven's sake. I presume you've been assisting Miss Reyes in tracking down this little problem. Well, clearly yes. there's more work to be done. Why don't you continue the work you've been doing with an assurance that the Trade Authority will compensate you for your time? I'll coordinate things here with Miss Reyes. With Mast's access to the grid, we'll find out who did this soon enough. And why. That is shady. Presumably, you're the one who's been doing the field work, so... I believe you'll find there's another junction box out there in the well that needs your attention. Okay, well, this is not how I saw this going. For the moment, let's assume this is all legitimate. I can sort out the details with Zoe. So why don't you go investigate the next junction box? Hey, I thought you were out there, you know. Someone can was... I leave my robot with you, just to be sure? I honestly do not trust this at all. The sooner you find the source of all this, the sooner it can be over. You okay with the Trade Authority? Does it matter? Sure seems like this is happening one way or another. I don't trust her, but I'll keep an eye on her. The Trade Authority is not responsible then who is? Honestly, I have no idea. I think that's actually even more concerning, and that's saying something. Uh, can I tell you to see here? I'm quite... Why exactly are you standing here instead of assisting us? How do we know you're telling the truth? As I said, I have been aware of the issues with the power grid for a while now. I've been taking notes, and Miss Reyes will be able to verify their authenticity. But really, do you honestly believe I'd go to this effort if I were somehow responsible? Why are you getting yourself involved in this? Oh, I'm not. I thought I made that clear. Someone evidently decided it was a good idea to try and frame me for whatever is going on. I would very much like to know who that is and why they thought they could get away with it. I admit I'm also quite curious to know what they're up to. Aren't you? I don't like you. Oh, but you stay here, okay? Hello. A citizen. Just 
just in case, because I do not trust the scripts and NPCs together, you know?
provide updates for any suspicious activity. Is that clear? And Zoe's here too, if you had a guest. We've agreed to work together on this. Once you throw the switch, we can direct you to the next junction box. Hey, hallelujah. Okay. Yeah, I don't like this interface. Yes, that's what I what I wanted to take a look at. What you find the weapons? Because I would like to actually uh yes, use this one with armor piercing rounds and take off what mods from any other weapon, if that is possible, like in Fallout. First, where is... Where is the uh, compass? Or muscle? Ah, muscle. Ah, okay. This is not range accuracy and stability as the cost of the fire accuracy. Muscle attachment. Last year it uses acoustic intensity while it is because it's the cost of range. Okay. Okay, the range is 20. Ah, 
Stadium, Stadium. Ah, oh, 
Okay. 
allows you to put your organic resources from native creatures at your outposts. Hmm. That's it, thanks. Let's just take a look here. Okay, you're going to want to head for box 45A. It should be near Apex Electronics. <laughs> you can't possibly be serious. Are you looking at the same diagram I am? 47B is obviously the next one. It's on the same level. Zoe, I know how to read. Ignore her. Head for box 45A, okay? No. I can't even get past this. When I when I aim to go down. I appreciate that you've listened to reason. Oh the my god, who the box should be just nearby. Who designed this mission? If I'm okay, uh that should be different because I mean basically you have to jump down from like maybe here to not get into the hitbox of, well, the way down, uh, to, well, yeah, yeah. the hitbox of the other junction box is on the way down, okay. and you cannot, You're going cannot to want the head pass for box 45A. without triggering it. should be near Apex Electronics. <sighs> Are serious? Are you looking at the same diagram I am? 47B is obviously the next one. It's on the same level. Zoe, I know how to read. Ignore. Head for box 45A, okay? What designs this? Oh my god. At least build fences.
How is your day going? Lovely people and gentle people of the internet. Come on, load faster, please. Reyes is still collecting the necessary diagrams and blueprints to accurately assess the situation. Before she returns, I'm going to make you an offer. Whatever you find at the end of this path, you bring it to me first. I'll be certain that Mast gets what it needs, but I trade in valuable information. I suspect you're going to find some. I guarantee you the trade authority will pay well. Consider that as you head towards the residential district. We can't pinpoint the source yet. But it's somewhere over there. Okay. Uh, let's let's give uh, the art. Let's overgive the art. Can I say that overgive? Is it the word? Uh, overgeben. Head over, not overgive. Mein Gott, Englisch. Uh, halt, good damage. Uh, the art, you know. This is the art, Samson. Your boys. Your stature. Hi. Healing in art is uh, more exciting than one would think. I have got your art. Shh! Are you crazy? I am not trying to. Keep your damn but voice I down. Why? You tricked me. What? Really? Wasn't that included in the transfer from last week? Get off your high horse. I didn't trick you. You're just not very observant. Okay. What do you have to complain about? You're getting paid? Everything went smoothly. No one got hurt. It's all part of the game, my friend. It pays to get your hands a little bit dirty. It pays very, very well. But I digress. Thank you for your uh, discretion. Now that our little transaction is complete, I should be on my way. Take care, and let's not talk about this again. Only a thousand? Back to it then. Okay. I wish I would have 
like you even with your grades yeah i'm sure a junior assistant is vital it's your foot in the door show initiative positive attitude and the sky's the limit i could see how you made her cheerleader go timberwolves <laughs> I'm going to be You're a glorified a ghost. Too. Infinity is always hiring. Always. Welcome to Infinity LTD's corporate headquarters. All visitors are by appointment only, I'm afraid. Okay. Ah, it works again. Oh, that's a bridge. Uh, New Atlantis Corporate Park. Cross Corporation. Was ist das? Wow, you look completely different. <laughs> it's me. I mean, you look great, but isn't it going to confuse him? He won't even recognize you. I'd be mysterious. Mm. Zoe, you are one in a million. What? Maybe for our third date, I'll be a redhead. And yeah, hands is my, my favorite life. place in the galaxy. What the fish? How can I help you be the best you possible? Hi, welcome to Enhance. Thanks so much for stopping in today. Oh, I'm enhanced. sure my staff and I can accommodate your every need. If you're here to try something new, or on a whim, or to replicate a look you've seen and loved elsewhere, or just want to love your reflection in the mirror a little bit more, we've got you covered. All our services and records are private and confidential, so no need to worry. to take patient confidentiality seriously. A breach of information could be a major problem for your business. 
Oh my god. You certainly put things bluntly, don't you? I guess, but it sounds like you take your patient's confidentiality seriously, so you have nothing to worry about. Didn't mean to scare you, I just meant that it's important for places like these to build trust with their patients. I did. But no, I, I do. I, I, I take it all very seriously. I... <sighs> Sorry, you, you, you just took me a little off guard. Why? To tell you the truth, I made a bit of a slip. Why are you telling me that? I may have lost a data slate containing the confidential Why information of numerous this? patients. Little things, you know, like payment, information, procedures done, age, birthdays, mailing addresses. Oh no, who am I kidding? This is so bad. If that information gets out, my business and reputation could be destroyed. No patient will trust me again. Okay, okay. Where is it? I mean, am I a mind manipulator or something? Because everyone is ordering me stuff to do for... Well, stuff that wouldn't be normally ha happen. That certainly isn't good. It sounds like you are resp irresponsible and bad at your job. Why didn't you just tell me all that? Yes, what's stopping me from spreading this info around? Yes, why didn't he tell me that? Because I sense a kind of aura around you, uh, an air of no I am a telepath. Also, it all just spilled out. I couldn't hold it in anymore. Uh, well, that certainly isn't good. It's not. People's private information is at stake, ready to be taken by any bad actor that finds that damn slate. And worse, my reputation and business is on the line. Please, I'm... Are you your only? You'll have to find that slate. So what again? Are you your only employee? All right, I'll find it. Where have you visited recently? Yes. Thank you. And... Let's see, I, I frequent the Terra Brew nearby, as well as Whetstone. I also stopped by the Valberg building recently. Thank you for doing this. You're a lifesaver. Please, come back as soon as you have the slate. Oh, and don't read anything on it. It's confidential stuff, remember? Okay. Is all the safe? Oh, yes, of course, sure. <laughs> Enhances proprietary register technology is absolutely the best in the settled systems. There is a reason we've been the number one most trusted brand for reconstructive and plastic surgery for two decades running. Okay, what kind of reasons bring people in here? Well, I'm not at liberty to disclose any of our patients' personal motivations or services. You understand, of course. But, gosh, it, it could be anything, really. Something simple or a, a total reconstruction. Why you're here doesn't really matter to me. It's just important that you're satisfied when you leave. Enhance will be here any time you'd like a different look. Ah, yes. What the? You yes. 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 have to so try in hands. Does she even know? Uh, okay, um... What is this? Uh... Distribution center. Waiting in the cargo hold. Alright, then... Okay. I guess... I guess there's nothing between us and setting up on a brand new world. You, uh, you ready to head out then? One last drink? Oh god, yes. Where did you put your bag away? Wow, immersion. I'm afraid, due to recent legislative action, 
I'm no longer able to allocate ships. I can, however, deal in general goods. What? Welcome to UC Distribution. Now, before you say a word, I am required to inform you that formal complaints cannot be filed until the customer feedback system is back online. I have been told it'll be up and running in two weeks, but you know how these things are. I am sorry for any potential inconvenience. Also, if you're here about a corporate account, I've been assured that deliveries will be back on schedule soon. Uh, okay, I'd like to see what you have for sale. Oh, well, certainly. Tight stuff, huh? What's this? Corporate knife, Eon. Side star. What is an N67 smart gun? <gasps> oh my god, are you expensive? Sheesh. 777mm and you do actually good damage. You have poor accuracy. Wow. Shattering breaks through even the strongest armor. Why are you called smart gun? I know something like that gun from from aliens. Oh wow. <laughs> okay. Rapid shot. What are you? Yeah, it's a shotgun even. Yeah, shotgun. Okay, 109 damage. Oh wow. 15x25 CLL caseless shell? No, wait, CLL shell, I don't know what that is. Okay, rapid is an attack speed, long barrel laser sight. Okay, wow. Wow. Haha. <laughs> to armor piercing rounds. They are heavy. Okay. Okay, she. What ammo do you sell? Uh, 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 uh. Okay, shotgun shell. Uh, 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 uh. Spacesuits. You see marine spacesuits. Hmm? Bad. Helmets. Okay, I get alien vibes. I get alien vibes. Eight. Canock bacon. Resources. Nadium. Uranium. Titanium. Interesting. Uh, what is it you do here? You mean besides providing a pleasant face for customers to interact with? It's all in the name. We distribute materials and products all around the United Colonies. Never a dull moment. Always something going on and four other things we need to be ready for. I know some people don't believe it, but we really do the best we can. Wouldn't still be working here if I didn't care. Okay. Right, right. Come back if you need something else. So are uh, you like, what the hell? Okay, so are you like a vendor or are you sharing your loot or stuff or I don't know any any products with anyone who pays? I mean, what exactly is that? Wow. Okay, beautiful actually. What's that? What the hell was that just now? Change the red light. What is it? Color pink? Still from? Of mine comes without a 
And I, I have a lot on my plate right now. And... What is it now? You don't look like a new hire stumbling through their first day. Now, who exactly are you? As in the elusive and mysterious constellation. Oh, wow. I used to read stories about you guys when I was a kid. Um, wow. Oh, this is perfect. <laughs> Kismet, really. I have a business proposition for you that could uh, help us both out. Very lucrative. You're a law and order type? Oh, well, this is perfect. <laughs> this job is literally serving justice. Gal Bank is the agreed party, and if you help me, you help all of us. I'm interested. Good. <laughs> Great. <laughs> well, confession time. I might just be a little desperate. See, the world of credit analysis, you know, dealing with deadbeats and reprobates is, uh, well, it's a tough field. What I need is a ringer, someone that can collect some of our top delinquent offenders. What I need is you. You work with me, and the fee you get will be huge. Let me guess, 1,000 credits? Tell me about, about the marks then. What's the difficulty with step collection? Oh! Many credits are we talking about? Yes! Yeah, I can tell you're eager. That's good. But we'll start small and work our way up to the worst offenders. Ah. Okay, interesting. What's so difficult for step collection? <laughs> if you haven't noticed, and I'm guessing you have, the settled systems is big. Like really big. Someone gets seriously underwater, they skip the system. And it's a real pain to track them down. Sad truth is, we can't track everyone down, so credit analysis always has a black eye when reporting to the higher-ups. Okay, tell me about some marks. <laughs> yes! <laughs> so, we got a galaxy-class con man took out a loan to franchise a restaurant. Turns out, surprise, it was a scam. And Dieter Maliki jumps system. He's holed up in a literal shack in the middle of nowhere. Can you believe it? <laughs> uh, the job is simple. Get Dieter to pay. And we don't want him dead. We don't want him hurt. Just close his account like an honest citizen. Oh, okay. Uh, is he dangerous? What happens if he die? How do I get him to pay? Well, I mean, yes. We're not the only ones looking for him. And you don't dome up on a dust ball unless you're serious about dodging your civic responsibilities. What happens if he dies? If he dies, then his assets go to probate. And we can get paid. So if he forces you into an it's you or him situation, it's A-OK -okay for Galbank's bottom line if you choose him. But I cannot stress this enough. Hey. This is not the ideal outcome. We wanted him liquidated, and we'd have put a tracker on him. How do I get to pay? Well, you may need to lean on him, scare him. Nothing illegal, just talk to him. And don't listen to any sob stories he tells you. Any job I give you, I guarantee there's not some poor sick aunt that needs credits for surgery. These are scofflaws, scum, flagrantly violating the terms of their gal bank <coughs> agreements. Okay, let's collect some debt. I'll send over all the details. You find Dieter and bring his account current. I hate to end on this note, but you know, not everyone's a straight arrow. If you cut a deal with Dieter, 
Honestly, I have no way of knowing. But don't expect any more jobs from me. Best of luck. I believe in you. Okay. If there is any way I can assist you, I'd be happy to. Wait, is that it? Alright, do you like working Good here? Good luck out there. I mean. There's so many things to get away. Is it worth it? Do you like working here? Absolutely. Gal Bank makes civilization possible. We make sure that our reputation is flawless. So people can depend on us to invest for their future, save up for a new apartment, or just buy some groceries. And true, collections isn't the most glamorous part of the bank, but we all serve our part. Well, every delinquent that's called us, there are so many that get to pay. Is it worth it? We have to try. Every time someone skips <laughs> out, those credits just don't go away. And those are credits that could have been a loan for a mom and pop trying to start a hydroponic farm. Or they could take a bite out of our share prices, I meaning all sorts of retirement funds pay out a little less. Now, I know it seems, well, hopeless. But what we do matters. Okay. Oh, and I'll talk with you. Gal Bank makes personal finance easy. Money? As long as you have some, should never be something to worry about handling. With Gal Bank, your money okay. is always safe. Always. Have you? No, Atlantis is a real safe city. Definitely. Which is cool if you like that sort of thing. To each their own. Hey. The music bothers me a little bit. Hey, hey yourself. I don't really. I don't really know how to respond to that. That is the fastest I have gone. With Eddie Gold. I mean, I'm your brother. It's nice to meet you. Sure. What are you doing here? Trying to get a job at Galbank. It's the big building with the word Galbank on it. I know, I am excited. Thanks for clearing that up. Yeah, I can agree. I assumed it was that other building over there, that one that says must. <laughs> yeah, you'd think so, but sorry, not a gal bank. Anyway, yeah, I'd like to be a banker. It'll be fun. Okay, why do you want to work at gal bank? Because magic isn't real, which means I can't be a necromancer. <gasps> I, I figured being a soul-sucking banker was yep. the next best thing. Can you tell me more about yourself? Why? Because I hate myself. I'm a social butterfly. It's just what people do. You should try it sometime. I'm a social butterfly. I miss still the way of things. Good damn it. Um, you know what? Let's move myself a little bit. Ah, I hope I'm above the health line. Were we talking? I sure hope not. Hey, I'm a social butterfly. Funny, I'm more of a caterpillar person myself, but fine, you win. I like to paint, I like to crochet, pretty much hate everything else. You're starting to grow on me though, like a fungus, but I like mushrooms. Guess that's the third thing. Funculus, Funculus will improve this message. Anything I can do for you? <laughs> yeah, find a gal bank teller and deposit oh, all your ah. cards into my bank account. It'll be paid, of course, eventually. What? What again? Yeah, find a gal bank teller and deposit all your cards into my bank account. It'll be paid, of course. Eventually. What are you doing here again? Trying to get a job at Gal Bank. It's the big building. Oh, funny. I like you. I'm sorry you feel that way. Anyway, yeah. I'd like to be a banker. It'll be fun. There must be some more behind this purse. Trying to get a job at... It's the big building. Yeah, I can read. Good for you. A lot of people can, but not everyone does. 
Anyway, yeah. I'd like to be a banker. It'll be fun. Why? Because magic isn't real. Uh -huh. I figured being a soul-sucking banker was the next best thing. See ya. <coughs> I like people watching. Mostly watching them be miserable. Trying to get a job? It's the big building. You're welcome. Anyway, yeah. I'd like to be a banker. It'll be fun. Later. She radiates strange energy. But hey, she likes black of focus, so hooray. Several other CEOs were 
attendants including synthetic solution message reporter and Hope Tech's very own Ron Hope. Right, he carries herself also made an appearance as one of Ryojin's founders and made a toast alongside Masako Yamada and Simon Taijo to future success. Ryojin Industries now hiring! Oh! Ryojin Industries has announced that we are once again hiring the best and brightest of the Settle Systems. As a corporation, we are always taking on new hires. However, public announcements of job opportunities are rarely seen, making this a first in the past three years. We hope that many inspiring engineers and opportunists will see this as a chance to join our ever-growing team. Our latest, uh, our latest ad campaign for interested candidates can be heard in both New Atlantis and Neon. Our job application is available on any Ryojin information kiosk. Our subsidiaries. Ryojin Industries is proud to include the following companies within our network. Arboron, Drone, Taicho, Astroneering and Tranquility. Arboron, Arboron, protecting what matters most. Number one in craftsmanship and style. Arbor Arboron has soared to the top of innovative weapons manufacturers. Faster than any of our competitors, we create reliable and durable products so you can feel secure when you need the most. Visit our storefront at Ryojin Tower in Neon today. Drone. The Hive Essentials? Much like the hard-working honeybee, Drone seeks to organize and improve upon your daily life with our line of household robots. We understand the importance of time, which is why our robots specialize in undertaking those mundane tasks of household maintenance and everyday chores. Chores. Spend your time doing what you want to do and let drone do the work. Check out our latest models at our sales office in the Luchi Tower. Taicho Astroneering. Style among the stars. The best design in spacecraft, period. Taicho Astroneering has led, to space, uh, has led the spacecraft industry in design for decades. We are consistently among the most recognized brands with multiple awards each year for luxury, quality and dependability. Our engineers and designers work hard to bring our customers the feeling of comfort and safety as you travel among the stars to reach your destination. This is our showroom as we to tower in the old. <sighs> Hydro Astroneering. Uh, uh, tranquility. Relax, revel revitalize, reflect. Our special blends are made with the finest ingredients, chosen for both flavor and aroma. Whether you need peace or energy, find what you seek with tranquility. Visit our store and meet our band master at the Ryojin Tower. Job application! Welcome to the Ryojin Industries job application. All questions must be answered in order for your application to be submitted. Work experience. How many years of experience do you have working in a secretarial position or corporate environment? It's safe. Familiar are you with Ryojin Industries and its product lines? None at all. What is your proficiency with computers in regard to typing and file management? Hi. What level of education have you completed? What is bachelor's? Uh, definitely high school. Do you have a history of criminal activity? Well, I actually have no history at all, but... Your application is now complete. To officially submit your application, please select the submit application below. Answers may no longer be changed beyond this point. Submit application. Thank you. Well, to you know, the world is... Well, thank you for submitting your application. Please report to Imogene's health on the operations floor at the Yushin Tower in Yule for your interview. What? No, okay, you know what? No. No, 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 no. Too much stuff going on at the same time. No, let's finish some missions, okay? Let's finish some missions. We have so much to do currently, and I need to drink some water because I'm getting very... ready, you know? Ryujin Industries is looking for the young, bright minds Oops. of the future. Apply today uh, the nearest kiosk. Which? That should be all right. Ah, you can see my health now. Very good. Uh, that. But wait, where is...
just... Ah. Uh. Jeez, my inhibitor. No. Ah. How do I get there? That is just not cool. This planet is not inhabited on the surface. Without a good helmet, where are you? What was my helmet? My Nikita, why is the flashlight not working? Star Collective and the UC are still fighting the colony war. We just need to convince her that President Abeyo isn't the same as her predecessors. That an adversarial UC is a thing of the past. Does Radcliffe even need to be involved? President Abeyo wants to foster relations, not fracture them. Keep up. We'll make sure she knows them. Good. I'll see you at the 1130 then. <laughs> You're not with interstellar affairs, too, are you? Uh, where do I need to go? This way, okay. No, I'm not feeling that bad. We have an appointment. We're seeing the doctor. That's it. I... maybe some other time. I have that report that's due. I talked to your boss. She agreed that you need to take care of yourself. I know it's tough, honey, but a lot of times, the earlier they catch something, the better it is. You're right. I know you're right. I just wish they wouldn't keep us waiting so long. We almost had to have an intervention to get my wife here. Hmm. None of my business. Unless you have names, please do tell me you have names. Okay. How long do we have to wait? You have to trust the civilians. The medical knowledge. It's taken it's taken weeks of talking to get my wife to come here. Yeah. The doctors the better get here is quickly. low risk, but that still means risk. Hmm. What's 
opposite head. Yes, but that is information. It is. Keep your nose clean. The last thing I want is to charge you for a DP in A and B, B and E, or heaven forbid, in MS. But at least then we wouldn't have to worry about a VOP, am I right? What? EID closures. <coughs> oh, uh, I'm so behind on those reports. I'm gonna drink nothing but terror brew and pull all nighters for a week to finish them. Sounds like a bad idea to me. who fought in the colony war. Well, what can you do? Okay. Thank you. can you finish talking or... Can you stop talking? But don't start talking again while I'm going away. in the entire galaxy. They also beat any prices, provided it's advertised. Oh god, I'm doing it too! It's not just the prices on individual items either. Their bundles are top tier. Uh, yeah. Uh, what's 
inside here. Okay, so this one. Yep. Wait. Okay, this the inner circle is ready. Uh Where is this 
fait. What do they even need a ship for? There's so many other things you can buy with those credits. something for me? Here's what I found. This is not good to mass. Here's what I 
And it's Jesus. How predictable and disappointing. But not final, yes? Do you have? Here's what I found. I'm glad you made the right decision. I'll look this over and make sure that Mast gets just as much as they need. Not a <laughs> bit more. The Trade Authority will not forget what you've done for us. 2,000 credits. 75 XP. Someone was attempting to hack Galvang? And at a glance, it appears they may have had some success. Mm, this will make for some entertaining late night reading. Well, Miss Reyes, it's been such a pleasure having you here. I'll be sure and pass along my compliments to your superiors. I hope whatever that is, it's worthless to you. And you know, I'm so not sure you weren't behind this all along, whatever this is. I'm sorry to hear you say that. I was trying to be sincere. Well, in any event, thank you for a wonderful diversion from my usual work. I have three projects that are back burned right now because no one has time to help me. Three! I totally understand that Mast has a tremendous amount to keep track of. I just wish it wasn't always my work that falls through the cracks. They said they were going to bring someone on to help out. Take some of the load off me. I said that two years ago. And now let's load. We get 2,075 XP. Well, 2,000 credits and 75 XP. Intuition skill makes food and drink more effective. Thanks for all that work. You can give me what you found now. So you tracked it down. You've got something to show for it? Yes, yeah, so is the authority. So is the trade authority purpose to pay for this? And oh, yep, here you go. Great. I'll get this back to mass for analysis. I'm not stupid. I know Zoe probably made you an offer. I appreciate that you didn't take it. And I'm really glad we got to work together on this. 2075. So, looks like maybe someone thought they could hack into Galibank's system. In fact, looks like maybe they did. Still want to claim you had nothing to do with this, Zoe? My dear, why in the world would I want to break the law? And Galbank, no less. I do quite enough business with them as it is. All right. Well, I'll have some people look over this. Maybe they'll be in touch. I very much doubt that. See you around. There are always about a million things to do, and I'm only one person. It's so overwhelming. I have three projects that are back burned right now okay. because no one has time to help me. The Trade Authority three. has access to goods and services no one else does. No one. Pleasure dealing with you. Yeah, I don't know actually what the difference is. Either I do my job, or... I mean, the only difference I currently see is just the... Morality? Uh, I don't know, maybe there's a difference in the future because I don't know, maybe uh, I get a good offer or favor from her or something or good deals, I don't know. But okay, goodbye. I totally understand that okay. Mast has a tremendous amount of. Blah, blah, blah. Colonies. It was founded in 2156, the same year humans first reached Alpha Centauri, set down on the planet they named Jameson. to do to, to be 
be able to uh, upgrade the lock picking. How do I refill my fuel? Two parties came Howdy. together to negotiate the terms of the armistice. Fleet sizes would be capped, mechs and xeno weapons outlawed, and all research related to those fields would be kept under lock and key in their own special <laughs> archive, which actually rests below our feet as we speak. Yes. And while these new restrictions transformed the settled systems overnight, entire economies were upended with the flick of a pen. They also marked the start of something critical. Cooperation between the United Colonies and the Free Star Collective for the first time in decades. A pledge between the powers for a more harmonious future. Thank you for listening. Okay, what's it? You got your clearances? Good. No. This is a shared Freestar UC territory, so act accordingly. Ah, 
but why do make technology? Xeno warfare, I understand, but why do Max, I mean, come on, Max. I think that's. I don't know. Uh, where is. Where is. Where is. Uh. Just tell me how many zeros I need to have in the offer. I'm sorry, sir, but we can't sell to you. You see citizens only. Ah! <laughs> I think I understand. And uh, the cost to put me down as a citizen would be... What exactly? Sir, bribery is a crime in the colonies. Fine. Perhaps I'll just be having a chat with your superiors then. Good day. You've seen the damn regulations. All I want to do is give the United Colonies my money. Why do they need to make that so challenging? I wonder how much this citizenship is going to be. What is this deal? A billion reality age. Looking to buy? Zora should be able to help you. UC homes can only be purchased by UC citizens, so you know up front. We've got some lovely places available, if you've earned your citizenship, of course. I'm always ready to make a deal. Hello. Yes, uh, I would like to see what you do here. Welcome to Feeling Realty. I'm Zora, and I'm here to help with whatever you may need. What brings you in today? Looking to settle down, or move up in the world, or just window shopping? <coughs> I just wanted in. I'd like to find some place to live in your tent. Yeah, I just wanted in. That's fine. It happens all the time. I never mind an opportunity to chat with someone new. I'm here if you have any more questions or if you'd like to look at properties. I'd like to hear about what you have to say, yes. You have any properties outside of New Atlantis? Oh, no. don't I wish. Between UC regulations and demand here in the city, I haven't had a chance to branch out yet. But you best believe I'm keeping an eye on the situation and actively lobbying for a little more leeway. I'd like to hear about what you have to for sale. Okay, let me just pull up your data. Oh, uh, about I'm the... sorry, but you're not a United Colony citizen. I'm afraid is property ownership also, here no? in New Atlantis isn't available to you. If, if you take the exciting step of becoming a citizen, we'll be here for you. But can I not just take a look anyway? As I've mentioned, property in New Atlantis is only available to United Colony citizens. That's one rule I'm not allowed to bend. Bye. 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 Enjoy Bye. your time in New Bye. Atlantis! Bye. Now, where is that thingy? It's a collective embassy. Ah, yeah, not now. One after another. Oh. Well, apparently I do. You know I want to chef. Because of possessor logic. I have no idea why I built up a CO2. Uh, As you can see, traffic is good. The sales keep climbing. Thanks for Why? choosing Terrible. What there can I get you? Locations in New Atlantis. Yes. Why the is there so much space here? Didn't deep at all when the second store opened. Hello. Times change, but one thing's constant. People need coffee. I need to report back, but this is very encouraging.
Thanks okay. for choosing Terrabrew. What can I... Yeah, yeah. Uh... Hi there. Welcome to Terrabrew. Okay, okay. I guess goodbye. Give me Martinez. You look suspicious. Down with the FC! What do you think should happen? The FC the... is nothing but a bunch of warmongers and murderers. What's your problem with the FC? What's my problem with them? Really? I'm keeping the FC accountable for the terrible things they've done. The colony war was an unforgivable <laughs> tragedy. Countless lives could have been spared, but the Free Star Collective was out for blood. The Free Star Collective took my father away from me. Uh, what happened with them? But all we have to spend. If it's planning to reality, that's not what happened, but did it? Oh, please. Grief has nothing to do with it. Facts are facts. And the fact of the matter is that my dad would be alive if the FC never broke the Treaty of Narian. Did they? Well, I want it torn down, of course. The fact that there's even an embassy for them here after what they did, it's infuriating. And what? Tear it down. Tear it all down. And what did the you? United Colonies do compared to them? Diplomacy is needed to make sure another colony war won't happen again. We need that embassy. Ha! Diplomacy? That doesn't mean anything to the FC. They'll break any law and treaty that they feel like. It doesn't matter to them. How do you know? My god, why, why are you one of the stupid people right. again? God damn it. I mean, my god. Where's your common sense? God damn it. Uh, she, that's just very one sided opinion. Meine Güte, ey. Okay, but where, wait. There's no thing here. Where did you else? Say you had stuff lost. That's it. That's it. So, where did you say you need your stuff? Uh, All of our services are designed to minimize pain and on. maximize happiness. Come back anytime. Doesn't tell me anything again. Oh no. Ah, ah, wait. Ask me to find this process. He said he used the terrible redstone and the Wildberg building. Okay, what is redstone and what is the Wildberg building? Uh. Listen, and. Ah. Talk to my insurance. Is that true? No. Did you really need to stop being such a pushover? Yeah. I think I need to talk to a lawyer. Let's do. I... What? Gal... What? Gal... Gal bank. Uh, no. You're getting these rashes under my thighs. It's cheap. Yo, 
Tusk, oh come on. That is... Oh, wait a second. That here. Ah, Savage Stone. Yeah? No, just Savage Stone. Okay, we found Savage Stone. Here maybe I expected to be laying around somewhere. What is this? Nothing. Is it the restaurant? Is it? Ah, special files. Files. I found it. Okay. Top shelf. Warner Connors data set for this for his entrance uh, enhanced business it contains pages upon pages of confidential patient information. He, he just left it laying around here. Welcome to Whetstone. Hello. I'd like to see what's on the menu. If you're looking does, for the best cut of meat in the settled systems, look no further. Does all of your food come from local sources? <laughs> you must be joking. I have an exclusive contract with the Trade Authority. It's all shipped in from Offworld. And no, I'm not divulging the planet of origin. Uh, what's a vet stone? The general term? A sharpening stone, for knives. The kind of knives that cut the most delicious meat in the settled systems. This whetstone, though, is the best restaurant you've ever eaten at. If you like a perfect steak, you're in the right place. Okay, I'd like to see what's on the menu. Why wouldn't? Yeah, hey, what do you have? Eat. A baguette. Can this be a weapon? Oh, it looks good. Can this be a weapon, please? Classic loaf of French bread. Restores three health. Shran Chandra Cabernet Sauvignon. Uh, Chandra Vineyard Stark Red Wine. Blah, 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 blah. Sparkling? Why? Hmm? Uh. Deep grilled pieces of alien salmon. It's a fish! Ah, so soft alongside mixed vegetables and mashed potatoes. That doesn't look like a fish. That doesn't look like fish at all. The rack. Smoked sap of rib served with mashed potatoes and vegetables. That looks good. The strip. A seared strip steak served alongside mixed vegetables. Top shelf. Ah yes. It doesn't look so bad actually. Okay. We got it. Help you in hand. No, I found your data set here. In hands? Can you find it? it before oh we talk? Oh my god, thank you so much. I, I don't know what to say. Maybe open you your mouth first. You have a humble businessman. You, you saved me and my business. I'm so grateful for Wait, that. how old are Thank I? you so much. And, I, I hope this hasn't tainted your perception of my wonderful facility. If you need any work done, I'll always be here. Also credits, me. If you'd ever like to make a change... Okay, now to the embassy. Embassy, yeah. Let's go to the Yes, 
Exactly. It's like... like... When someone insults you, you want to just... get the shit out of them, sometimes. Uh, but you don't. <laughs> well, not quite what I was thinking, but that's actually a great example, Marcus. The man in the story was cruel. Do you know why he was cruel? You must feel what he feels. Understand his pain. Accept it. And deliver it not back upon him. Empathy. You mean empathy. But you say it like it's easy. Like anyone can... just... love a terrible person who has been terrible to them. Yeah. Why even bother? I mean, isn't the cycle of humanity peace and war back and forth? Like forever? Seems kind of pointless to try so hard for something that won't last. Nothing ever really changes. It's, it's not easy, no, but necessary. Nothing ever really changes. Because you see, everything has changed. <laughs> God has given us the intelligence, the ingenuity to reach into the stars, to travel his path, to truly find him. But we can't do it alone. The only way is through unity. Huh. Yes, Andreas. Yes. Unity. Well, I'm sure you all have other things to do. Thank you for taking the time to stop and talk with me. There's so many mysteries in the universe, so many unknowns that I try to help out others whenever I get the chance. I may not always have the perfect Thank advice for people, but I try to just be here for them. I think that's what they really need more than anything else. Were you seeking worldly wisdom or just a friendly ear? Uh, I'm trying to find the lodge. I'm not seeing anything. Life would be good to start. I'm trying to find the lodge. Ah, the intrepid explorers. Well, you're very nearly there. Just down the path. They're an interesting bunch. Path of two. I hope you enjoy your visit. And I may say, if perhaps once you've done with Constellation, and you find yourself desiring more, let's say, metaphysical <laughs> knowledge, consider stopping by the church and reading some of our writings. Among the grav jumps is a good starting point, I think. Perhaps we could discuss it when you've had a chance to look it over. I am always interested to hear new opinions. Uh, I don't think I have had leisure. That's all right. I'm sure it just escaped your memory. So many things do over time. There must be a copy around here somewhere. If you do happen to peruse it, I would enjoy hearing your thoughts on the idea. Oh, wait. Did I find this book? Wonderful. I really would be happy to discuss it with you sometime. Wait a second. Is there anything I can help with? The reputation of running a tight ship sometimes. I worry it's too tight. Taskmaster? You tell me about a priest? Keeper by title. But yes, I suppose the title fits. I'm very grateful that I have the opportunity to be here for those who need us, who find meaning in our message. And can you tell me about the Sanctum Universum? Well, we're a newer organization, at least officially. Our facility here in New Atlantis has only been around a few decades. But we're gaining new members all the time. I think people have been grasping for something to express what they're experiencing and I'm glad we can be here for them. Is there something like Scientology? What is that? <laughs> no, that's not true. We'll always be here. Hello. Ah, yes. Alright, you okay. FC is no friend of you and me. Uh, safe? Hello. 
Only those with an appointment are allowed inside the embassy. I have something had something like that. What did I just say? I have something like that. Welcome to the Free Star Embassy. Is there something I can help you with? Yes. Representative Chisholm is being held as a spaceport by UC Security. Which is diplomatic visa. visa. Who can enter the embassy? Unless you have an appointment, only Free Star diplomats and security members are allowed inside. And because you're asking the question, I take it you don't have one. Anyway, uh, one of your representatives forgot his diplomatic visa. What's that? <laughs> That's basically what happens. You can't forget what you don't need. Diplomatic visas haven't been in use since the colony war. Oh. No, this sounds to me like a guard bought a red marker and colored some tape. I'll make a call to Sergeant Yumi and see if I can't get this squared away. Thanks for the tip. Oh! Another five! Yay! Five stars. Okay. Don't you worry. I'll have our people go and fetch the representative. What happens if I say the other thing? Manufactured components are used when building outpost modules and certain weapon and equipment mods. Can be created at an industrial workbench or by a fabricator in an outpost. Fabricator? Oh, okay. The guards Hello? will check you at the elevators. Try not to make a fuss. Welcome to the Free Star Embassy. Is there something I can help you with? Or can enter the embassy? Unless you have an appointment only for. And because a representative Chisholm is being held as a spaceport by UC security. Ah, <sighs> typical UC security. They try to bully us every chance they get and still manage to play the victim. I get this squared away with the folks down at the spaceport. Thanks for letting us know. Oh. Not much of a difference. the first option more. The class of the ship is based on its reactor class. Class C reactors provide the most power but have the lowest max speed. The guards will check you at the elevators. Try not to make a fuss. Hmm? Welcome to the Free Star Inn. Unless you have an appointment and because you can't forget what you don't need. Diplomatic visas haven't been in use since the colony war. No, this sounds to me like a guard bought a red marker and colored some tape. I'll make a call to Sergeant Yumi and see if I can't get this squared away. Thanks for the tip. No. Good, can I talk with him back again? Uh, wait, L, no, wait, uh, this, yes, G, yeah.
not be as good as you. Okay, the Z has been resolved and missions. I'm sorry, I really can't afford to be distracted. I need to get to the bottom of this. Uh, is something wrong? You sound concerned. You seem to be staring at the tree. Yes. Concerned is an understatement. I work for the scientific division of MAST. I've been studying this tree for quite some time, and it appears to be exhibiting some worrying signs. Are you familiar with this particular specimen? Do you understand its importance? Look, I have a lot of work to do here. If you're just going to gawk, I'd ask that you move on. If you can actually assist me, however, I would appreciate it. <laughs> I don't normally solicit help from random passersby, but it seems an exception is necessary. Would you be willing to retrieve some additional data for me? I'd love to help. Well, that's... thank you. That's unexpected. Ah, there's a series of biosensors I've placed in various locations around New Atlantis, all calibrated to gather pertinent information. They've been running for long enough that I think it's time to collect and analyze their findings. If you would bring them to me, that would save time. Okay. Okay, it's the biosensors. Okay, which one is the closest? There are apparently only three. Ah, yeah, okay. Let's take this one first. We may be in a United Colonies city, but Constellation is an entirely neutral entity and always has been. Apparently I am on the right track. Wait. Okay, 
You gotta let her go. We got the other children. Grandkids, too. But Sheila had such fire in her. She could have been anything. I miss her, too, but after the accident, it's a mercy. She was the way Got a she call, someone's power kept going out. You know what it was? Extra day a heat leech as long as my leg. That would have been the blessing. <sighs> miss my Sheila every day. My husband's never been the same since our daughter passed. You could have a whole batball field or some food stands. Something useful. It's always something with you. It's a playground too, right? Like I've seen all there is to see. But hopefully I'll I'll get it. just enjoying the view. <laughs> These days my favorite thing to do is sit and listen. The wind, the trees, they all have their own language. Sometimes they even sing. I feel like I can help you with any tasks. Can you tell me about your life? I'm close to 80 years old, so I will spare you the long version. <laughs> to put it simply, I lived, and I loved, and really, does a person need anything else? Well, uh, yeah, I sure as hell do. To live and love is more than enough. That's okay, but I could do this if you will. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? Couldn't we all? But I think you'll find that a few more credits will not make you happy. Uh, you misunderstood what I just said. A lot of credits, maybe. But only because it gives you the time to find what really makes you happy. Do you have any advice for me? You don't need my advice. You're alive. And you've survived everything that comes with that title. Which is I'm to a say, survivor. you survivor. are an achievement. Never forget that. Okay. Oh, it just so happens I need a letter delivered to my pen pal in Sidonia. Pay is in advance. One thousand credit. Okay, I'm interested. Uh, why trust the setter to a stranger? <laughs> what is a stranger except a friend you haven't met? Besides, there's what? something about you that I like. And I've always trusted my gut. What if I'm a pirate? Who is this pen pal? Her name or is Patty. She used to live in the apartment I live in now. I used to get all her packages because she never bothered to change her address. One day I tracked her down and sent her a letter. She sent one back. And from then on, we just never stopped responding. But by me, why not the off post office? All right, I'll help you. Bless you, child. I believe you'll find Hattie at the community center in Sidonia. Just hand her the letter. She'll know who it's from. Mm-hmm. 
sure a stranger just walks up to someone on another planet and hands you a leather. Wow. Which <laughs> Yeah, well, what, what could go for all? Oh, wasn't there anything else? I mean, how more suspicious could you be? Big five looks. Oxygen would be nice. I don't know. What is now? Okay. Why air quality? Come on, this is tough. Why? Right. Uh, stop it. Okay. Are you looking for eggs too? What eggs? <gasps> Don't tell me you hunt for these eggs. I've only found one so far, but I want to find more before anyone else does. So if you see some, can you tell me? Um, the egg you found wasn't beeping, was it? Yeah, it was. Weird, right? I was stupid or Miss Seng over at UC Distribution bought the one I found, and she said she might buy more <coughs> if I can find them. Oh I could God. really use the credit. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, you are apparently a child of um, unstable income housing. Sorry, I can't play right now. I'm grounded. Okay. Yep, so that's not an egg. Next time I'm going to tell my friend. Basically stole something and sold it. Wait, don't tell me a competent person just person just bought it. may require multiple levels of approval and can take up to several weeks for an official response. We apologize for any delay. Welcome to UC Distribution. Something I can do for you? You bought an egg from a kid recently. I need it. Who? Jordan? <laughs> that kid's in here every other day with some random thing he found. <laughs> Trying to get credits. Yeah, I took pity on him. Why? What is it? Sensitive scientific equipment, very important. Oh, really? 
Well, yep. you can have it back for what I paid for it, plus a little extra. Let's call it a convenience fee, shall we? Dude, do I have to make it clear for you that you just bought stolen scientific goods, which I'm here to retrieve? Can't you just give it to me, like literally? I could, but I did pay for it. So what? I'd like to recover my losses. Yeah, it's and your... It's all the way in the back room. I'd have to walk back there, then back out here. Dude, it's your problem, I did problem, say this honestly. was important, after all. Honestly, it's probably worth way more than what we're talking oh about. Oh my god. Do, you don't realize your position, don't you? Woman, uh, even if you would have been a man, If you are a pawn shop and you bought something valuable that was stolen and the, well, let's say I'm not an authority, but maybe, but people tasked to retrieve it because it was stolen. Um, you will have to return that too, not without being in the position to, ask to fill them here, to so if we pay for this it, up. would you pay? You know, you understand what I mean. Now imagine I. In fact, I am part of the UC security currently. I got officially hired by Sergeant Yubi. Yubi. Forget it. Sit yourself. Back to it then. Saw your ship coming. Nice ride. You know what? I'll take it back. An incompetent person bought it. I'm pleased to report that our stocks are currently being maintained at 90% or higher. I'm sure we have anything you might need. Welcome to UC Distribution. Something I can do for you? Well... Still need this. You can have it back for what I paid for it, plus a little extra. Let's call it a convenience fee, shall we? Now the option to, uh, what was it again? Uh, 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 uh now, um, ah, uh, What did we do with the pirates yesterday? Uh, to convince or convince? Persuade. A persuasion option would have been Would have make would have made a lot of sense right now in this situation. My God, that is just what you call it? it? Infuriating, almost. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, woman, you have no idea what you just did. Like. You do, oh my You're always God. welcome back, if you don't mind a bit of a wait. I've met my so many interesting people from working God. at the distribution center. Our 
I, I need all of the biosensors if the data is to be of any use. Put all your sensors right here. What exactly are you going to put? Recent scans of the tree have suggested that a significant portion of the interior has liquefied. I... Obviously, some small percentage of its internal workings is always liquid to allow yes. for the transfer of nutrients and so forth, but this? Well, I've never seen anything like it. If it continues to increase, I'm concerned the entire tree may collapse, and I'm also worried about other secondary effects. Okay, it's end of the day, it's just should this area be blocked should should this area be blocked off just to be safe? What do you mean? Secondary effects. It's uh, too soon to speculate. I'd very much like to see the additional data before I say more. Should this area be blocked off just to be safe? If the time comes, I will certainly attempt to alert the appropriate people in mast. If I have more data though. My concerns might carry some more weight. You will get to the bottom of this. I appreciate your confidence. The sooner I have all the available data, the sooner I can make an assessment. I've got all your sensors right here. So you do. Wonderful. I'll just take these, and we'll see what they have to tell us. All right. We'll just upload the data. Give it a moment. And just another moment. What is happening? What will happen? Go? It is working, isn't it? Ah, there it is. Relief. Now let's see. This is well. It's oh my. Concerns were valid all along. Well, there's good news and bad news. The good news is that my suspicions were correct. There is something wrong with the tree. I will report my findings to Mast immediately with no small amount of satisfaction. The phrase, I told you so, may even be uttered more than once. And what is... Well, from a certain point of view. In an admittedly somewhat selfish manner. The bad news, as it were, is that the internal composition of the tree is changing. In this particular case, the tree is now regularly emitting ultra-low frequency sound waves. What? They're nearly imperceptible now, but they're growing in strength. This is something what? we've never observed before. Depending on how large these waves grow, consequences for the city could be oh, disastrous. What? I must consult with my colleagues in MAST at once. Thank you for your assistance. I hope these credits are adequate compensation. Oh, so? Nice. What? Check in on Ted data. The data from the biosensors speaks for itself. Where 
exhibition boards. relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. Okay. Um, yeah. Why? I don't know why the mark is not getting moved to Gagarin. Really? What's there to even do on Gagarin? Beats me, but the financials make sense. Well then, we're going to have to give you one hell of a send-off. You, madam, have a deal. Kill the pirate freebooter on Kirby. Bounty Trackers Alliance contract. We are offering a reward for anyone who eliminates the leader of notorious group of crimson pirates. Last seen as a deserted biotech slab on Kirby in the Alpha Centauri system. A bird freebooter Kirby. Sorry, what? Okay. Deliver broadcast notes to Gagarin. Trade Authority contract. Hello, 19,081. I don't have that much space. Wow. The fourth meet Volvo. Oh my god, that is too much. I don't have that much cargo space. I could almost do 450 kilograms. I could do that too. Okay, so light frames to a killer. Oh, League of Independent Setters contract. Tau ZD5678B and Tau ZD is reported to have potential for life. To have potential for life. Uh, we are looking for an experienced explorer to survey it for us. Payment will be automatically credited to your account once Tower City 5678B has been fully surveyed. Not bad, actually. Interesting. But first, let's continue with our main mission because it seems that we did everything now. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Keeping the peace. What's that again? I can do that. Now. Two, by the way. Um, I need to go. 
for hours. What am I even doing so long here? fewer people there are thinking about Aegis on a daily basis, the easier my job is. What is it you do here? I'm the acting head of Aegis, the intelligence division here in MAST. I oversee all our active projects and agents in the field, and I'm afraid that's about as much detail as I can give you. What can you tell me about Aegis? All you really need to know is that we're here to serve and we're the good guys. Our main priority is the safety and security of the citizens and assets of the United Colonies, wherever they may be. We keep an eye on... well, everything. Must be hard not being able to talk about much. Any agency that feels the need to point out they are good guys, good guys usually aren't. So, your spice? How many agents do we have looking for you? <laughs> Of course, you will tell me that. Yeah, sure. Well, you're certainly entitled to that opinion. And there are plenty of others who share it. We'll be looking out for you just the same. Ah, okay. The name is Plato? <laughs> no. My parents would never have been so presumptuous. Every agent who joins Aegis gets to choose a pseudonym, pending approval, of course. I chose this for myself when I signed on. I have, of course, since learned that I am not nearly as smart as I thought I was as a younger man. I suppose none of us are. What's Aegis? We're the intelligence arm of the United Colonies. Think of it this way. <coughs> you see security response to threats. It's Aegis's job to anticipate and prevent them. I was asked about, uh, I was asked by UC security to pick something up. Ah, right. You're Sergeant Yumi's recruit. You're taller than I expected. Okay. Thanks, I guess. Oh, you know that. 
Thanks, I guess. Oh, it wasn't a compliment. Just an observation. In any case, let me fill you in. We have a dead drop that we think has been compromised. So I'd like someone from UC Security to handle the pickup instead. Take the package back to Sergeant Yumi and he'll check it in as evidence before it gets routed back to Aegis. Okay, go ahead, just tell me what to pick it up. I'll get back to you. What do you mean? The location's been compromised. Why meet with me personally? Uh, am I back? Am I back? Are we back? We are back. Okay, I don't know what that was. I am sorry about that. And now I don't know how much you missed. Hmm. Anyway, uh, we are here to pick up a package that was has been compromised. So why are we from the UC security picking it up and not what if you, uh, and not an agent of ages? Uh. To prevent uh, <coughs> agents getting compromised. Yeah, so therefore, different personnel has to do it. Why meet with me? Would you personally? prefer to continue this? Well, I told the sergeant that anyone hired for this job should get my stamp of approval first. Nothing personal. It's just this sort of work isn't part of your normal detail. Okay, got it. Just tell me where to pick it up. Take the NAT to the spaceport. There should be a Galbank ATM right next to the station. The package is taped under one of the benches. Grab it and deliver it to Sergeant Yumi and the job's done. Hmm. What's in the package? You really should know better than to ask for classified intel. What is this, your first day on the job? Yes. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm just giving you a hard time. I still can't tell you what's in the package, though. Good luck with the mission. Okay. Goodbye. He seems nice. Okay. Not the station. Okay. Ich bin Platos, Pikachu. 
How's the invest? I've got your package. Have... Nicely done. It's really hard to find good help these days. That being said, my luck seems to be turning around. We've gotten a lot of new personnel as of late, not just you. Okay. Who knew all I had to do was put up a sign? That it worked out. Whatever, just keep my credit. I would make a habit of recruiting people off the street. Well. I have you now, so I probably won't hire another person for a while. Oh. Anyway, here's your payment. And if I have any more work for you, I'll let you know. I think I just, uh... Stole the job for so many people. No, um, is that it? I'm looking for more, uh, for work if you have ah. any. If it isn't my favorite part-time security officer. That is exactly what your smile says. How are the day-to-day -day operations going? Uh, it's a lot of work, as always. People like to say, New Atlantis is the safest city in the settled systems. How hard could your job be? Well, safety doesn't happen by accident. It takes a lot of work and a lot of people. I'm looking for work if you have it. I've got nothing at the moment, but come back later. And I might have something for you. Okay, let's continue with the story mission. Fine. Take care. Goodbye. Jesus Christ. I know what to do. Skills. Weapon mods. Uh, take. Science. Weapon engineering. Wait. I need to wait. Let me take a look at the web at a web workbench again.
know what to say uh, while waiting uh, for loading screens. I, all, all I can do is compliment the, the screenshots. Where are we are here. Why are we here? Uh, God damn it, that's the wrong map. The guy wanted to talk with me. No, no, this. No, here. Here? to recharge. It's not mandatory, but people notice who's there and who's not. We nail this, and careers are going to change. And the bonus. I know, I know. I just hope it's worth it. I... I can stay for a little while longer. It's just three more days. Two all mortars Corpse demands so much of his employees. It's inhumane. Something just came in. Scuffle over at the Dawn's Roost. Security on site handled it, but now one of them is saying the other guy stole his wedding ring. Oh. Problem is, he left without identifying the perp, so I need you to talk to Royce Elgin at the Dawn's Roost. See if you can fill in the gaps. Uh, why does he leave without identifying the assailant? Men like him aren't very generous with their time. They want you to solve a case without ever having to lift a finger themselves. Not that he'd be much of a witness, given that he was still half drunk when he got here and somehow even more so when he left. Sorry, wrong word. Rich people don't get drunk, they get inebriated. Which is another way of saying highly unreliable. Okay, I can do that for you. Good. Report back here when the matter's resolved. But first... Yeah, what's Dawn's host? But first, main story mission fighting. Over in the residential district. 
Get us to a very fancy clientele. It's the kind of place where forks come in different sizes. Oh, why? How about depending on the food? Anything else I should know about the case? According to the patron, the ring is valuable, but if I had to guess, not for sentimental reasons. Normally, when someone loses a valuable keepsake, they're heartbroken. The way this guy was acting, it's almost as if he lost a wallet full of creds. Back to work then. Fast travel. I cannot fast travel to anything else, can I? Because protocol indigo and stuff. Hi, Jesus Christ! Welcome to the end of the stream, basically. Oh, God. I did nothing. I was just walking around on this planet. But can I? Where did I come from? Narion. How are you doing? Good in Nacht or Morgan, whatever you do. Hallo, meine Güte. So much long loading. Hm. Let's do that, then do, do the main mission, and then I hope we have the free. an iceberg fishing for a dinner that will eat him I'm just saying it's an option All of our signature dishes are unique to the roost. You won't find anything like them anywhere uh, else. I'm here about a fight that happened at your restaurant. Ah, uh, a most unfortunate incident, complicated by the fact that both parties were inebriated. While I wasn't privy sure. to the entire argument, Hugo and Octavio have been dining here together for quite some time. So, it was surprising to see them at each other's throats. I need to find one of the patrons involved. Apparently he's told something. Uh, can you describe the patrons? Well, the one who stayed with UC security, Octavio, is a shorter man, handsome and refined. Uh, his favorite menu item is the Saint, I believe. The other, Hugo the Fournier, is a tall, dog. slender gentleman mm -hmm. with a French accent. Excellent tipper, well-mannered, but... The bartender it, outside your reach. <laughs> he has to throw the tricks towards you. 
Do you know anything about the stolen wedding ring? I wasn't witness to any theft, and both men were wearing rings, if I recall correctly. No. Uh, these two men dined together? Oh, yes, quite often. Uh, they had a usual table over in the far corner, with all the traditional accoutrements. Music, candles, wine... Oh. You see where I'm going with this. Oh, but okay. But this time the two had barely sat down before the argument got heated. Thankfully, security stepped in before anyone got hurt. I see. I need to find one of the patrons involved. Apparently he's told something. I assume that would be the slender gentleman, Hugo Fournier. He was the one who excused himself after you see security arrived. I believe he lives in Athena Tower, although he may be checking out soon. But I would start there. Okay, this place looks expensive, by the way. The Dawn's Roost represents the highest quality, from the ingredients to the decor. No expense is spared. Anyone who has sampled our offerings will assure you it is all worth it. I would like to see a menu. Yes, of course. What do you sell? Liar, that manipulator. Of that course he's French. Dear, dear, rotten scoundrel, I have got you now. You will pay for the crimes you have committed in Skyrim and to the... Oh, wait, no. One game. Uh, man who's charged you with theft. Go on, finish your rant. That lying, cheating, foul piece of Don Glider dropping. If I had my way, I'd tie him to the back of a ship and grab jump it right into the nearest star. Five years we were together, half a decade! And he threw it all away for that waiter! <gasps> Cordon bleu! The ex claims to store the drink. What happened to the dance host? To a dating? Of course, sir, but why should I ask? 
Uh, what happened is the dawn froze. It was supposed to be a romantic dinner. Our last before we pledged our lives to each other. Oh. But an hour before, I decided to do some cleaning to calm my nerves. I picked up a pair of pants he left on the floor and out falls a napkin from the dawn's roost with a number written on the back. To think he had the audacity back. to schedule a date with me at the same restaurant? Back I was livid! Still, I went to the date and held it together just long enough for the waiter to serve us. Then I went on. Oh, he's not French. He can pronounce the R. To the dating? Not just dating, betrothed. And I have the engagement ring to prove it. The ex claims you. Sh oh, is there any chance you two can patch things up? No. There are some things in life that cannot be repaired. Cheating is his way of saying, I don't love you. And without Mitch. love, what's the point? Bitch. Bitch. Please clarify, my good man. Uh, how exactly is. Owning a napkin with a phone number written on it. How is exactly is that cheating? Oh my god, this game has so many logic holes. Jesus Christ, you won't believe it, but earlier, just earlier, I was doing a mission for scientists. I was going around trees and collecting a biological sensor looking like uh, eggs on a stick. Either yes? say something or leave. As I said, repeatedly. And uh, as it turned out, one egg uh, was picked up by a boy who then sold it to a something like a postal office lady. So basically, let's say a vendor. Yes, yeah, a vendor. Because you can buy stuff. Uh, now, what did happen? I told her it's not an egg, it's an important scientific biological scanner. She then told me, well, I can uh, have it if I pay for it. With an extra fee, but that is not important. At this moment, I would have loved to have the option to persuade her, like what we did with the pirates, or to simply tell her and remind her of her, by law, remind her of her current position. Because basically what she did is buy something stolen. Buying something stolen. Something that was stolen. And now she charges. By the way, at that time I, I was hired as a, a, a security officer along the way. But... I couldn't even mention that. And um, she was offering me to basically pay for it. Because she paid for it and she doesn't want to... Uh, well, she wants to cover her losses. Woman! You are not in the position to demand something like this. Because imagine you are a pawn shop and you bought something without knowing that uh, something that was stolen now the police or anyone else comes to you to demand said item back in this position again you are not to demand payment for that stolen item because what you basically did is buy off stolen goods and that does, and that definitely does not look good for you watching from a juris, uh, juristical perspective. You know what I mean? And so it's. Hi! Meow! Oh my god, hab ich dich geweckt? I'm so sorry. Hi, wie geht's dir? Hi, du hast gerade geschlafen. Ich sehe das doch. Hi. Hallo, miau, miau, miau. Hallo. Oh. Hi, wie geht's dir? Möchtest du auf meinen Lab? Möchtest du? Du willst komm mal zu mir. Komm mal zu mir. Oh, ein Bett. Genau. Hi. Wie geht's dir so? Oh. Hi, nein, 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 bleib hier, bleib hier. Bleib hier. Bleib hier. 
Nein, es ist gerade geschlafen. Sorry, habe ich dich geweckt? Nein, wie geht's? Möchtest du weiter schlafen? Das ist nur das Problem. Hallo, schnur, schnur, schnur. Ja. Aber bitte schlaf nicht auf meinen Armen ein, okay? Du kannst gerne auf meinem Schoß liegen, aber nicht auf den Armen, okay? Oh. Hier, komm auf die Decke. Ja, genau hier. Hier ist gut, hier ist perfekt. Lass mich dein Püpüchen kraulen. Das magst du scheinbar, dann rollst du dich hin. Jawohl, jetzt liegst du auf der Decke. Oh. oh. Maus. Ah, gehen. Du bist... Du hast gerade geschlafen. Yes, did you? Hi. Oh, Krauli, Krauli, Krauli. Ja, äh, also, ähm, wo war ich? Sorry, ich muss gerade Steuern zahlen. Äh, äh, wo war ich? Also, äh, yes, and, äh, ja. Yeah. In the end, I had to pay. Uh, 100 credits to get that item. Or I could have stolen it, but honestly... I... Yeah, it's... Yeah, no. It, it was just a, a, a hundred credits. But... Yeah, there were so many missed opportunities in that uh, conversation. You know what I mean? And though I currently do not see the chat, I see something. Hell, something fluffy like on the ground. Ja, ich rede mit dir. Äh, ich rede mit dir. Ich Sind alle anderen schlafen? Sind alle anderen schlafen? Nein, bleib doch hier. Okay, möchtest du? Warum hast du dich umgelegt? Hier ist doch eine schöne Decke. Mann, warum muss ich mich weiter zu dir drehen? Ja. Oh. Ja, du magst das. Oh Gott. Ja, du bist... Du bist... Du bist ein süßes Kind. Du bist... Du bist so freundlich. Du kletterst gerne die Gardine hoch. Ja. Du frisst gerne die Wand. Ah, oh, streckig, 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 Bäuschlein. Streckig, streckig, streckig. Streckig, streckig, streckig. Ja, du hast schöne Pfote, du hast sanfte Pfote. Okay. Okay. Gehst du jetzt wieder? Oder? Ich bin hier. Ich bin hier. Ja, möchtest du weiter schlafen? Wenn du mich jetzt gerne... Oh. Ah, ich hasse dich wieder hingelegt. Zum Fuß. Na? Oh. Nur bleib doch liegen. Ja, oi. Hast du eine Rolle gemacht. Okay. Kann ich bitte weitermachen? Du kannst hier ruhig liegen. Pass auf, das Wasser. Vorsicht, Wasser. Vorsicht, Wasser. Wasser. Yes, Vorsicht. Vorsicht, your water. Yes, please be careful. Thank you. Okay. Gehst du wieder? Okay. Du kannst hier ruhig bleiben, okay? Ja, ja. Ah. Au. Ja, ich... <lacht> Au. Ich streichel dich doch schon. Kannst du dich nicht hinter mich legen? What the... Sorry, people. Uh, I have some uh, reality stuff currently coming up. Ah, du, ich muss hier voll die Gymnastik machen. Komm hier. Okay, jetzt wächst du dich. Okay, I think... Are we good to go? Okay, we can continue. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Jesus Christ. That is what... Um, I had experienced 
this is the one major for the day major logic hole that I have experienced because I expect as a game to have in their time to have similar rules compared to our today time you know Möchtest du weiter gestreichelt werden? Du kannst du ruhig noch liegen bleiben, okay? Ich meine, ich, der Stream sollte eigentlich schon zu Ende sein, aber nun ja. Ich glaube, wir machen wieder Overtime today. Ja, okay, kann ich? Hast du genug? Du kannst hier ruhig schlafen bleiben, okay? Wenn es ist nie gerade spät. Okay, ist gut. Bleibst du hier? Okay. okay. Oh ja, schlaf schön. Danke zum Vorbeikommen. Yes, ähm, äh, was das Game ist nice so far? Das ist eine gute, eine gute Nacht. Also, wait, uh, but the game is nice so far. Yes, yes, the game is nice. Uh, gute Nacht. I don't know if you, ja, yeah, wenn du, wenn du jetzt schlafen bist, gute Nacht. Ich hatte hier nur gerade. Uh, ich weiß nicht, ob du mein Twitter, uh, mein Tweet gesehen hast, aber ich habe. Um, sagen wir mal. Additional Harrigan Content. Content hier. Uh, <coughs> <clears throat> yeah, so, um, your ex claims you stole the drink. He would say that, but as far as I'm concerned, it's my property. Uh -huh. He gifted it to me when he proposed. It's not uh -huh. his to return. Fair enough. Nice, eh? Yes. Yeah, you can see me. 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 You can see Streichelt, damit du wieder runterkommst und einfach hier schlafen gehst. Okay, ich meine, hier liegt eine Decke, obwohl du auch nur mit deinem Hintern drauf liegst, aber Decke ist Decke. Okay. Okay. Gut, kann ich, wenn wir weiter streamen. Ach, aber hier kann ich persuaden. It's still a problem. No, it's not. Why the silence? Are you going to arrest me or not? No, I do not agree. It is not his property. It is his property. If it was uh, gifted, it is his property now. Yes, he paid it, but it is not his anymore. Agree, there's no crime here. I'll tell Sergeant Jimmy you're free to go. Yeah. I'm glad you could see reason. This ring is going to fund a very long vacation across the settled systems. Hm. Maybe I'll even take pictures. Ah ja, äh, und ich habe Asthma. Warum? Wo geht's hier raus? Ah, weil es ab und zu schlechtes Wetter gibt. So schlecht, dass mein Helm mich überhaupt nicht schützt, aber jeder andere Zivilist, der hier rumläuft, einfach gar keine Probleme damit hat. Okay. Wer ist Luke Captain? Ja, äh, 
Das Spiel ist soweit äh, ganz, ganz nett. I, I like the game. It's fine. Oh, jetzt wächst du dich. Ich habe saubere Hände, ich schwöre. Ah, perfect. Did you manage to get the ring back? Uh, the ring wasn't stolen, it was gifted. <sighs> really? I should have known this was a waste of time the moment I laid eyes on that drunk. That's on me. Without saying names, there are some people in this city who treat us like their personal security service. But you know how it goes. Sometimes we protect, other times we serve. Either way, I'm still going to pay you for your time. Thank you. Here, take this. It's well deserved. Four thousand? It had quite XP. Wow! I just did like I, I just. It was like five minutes. I literally just talked with two person. I talked with two persons. Wow, okay. Main mission. Let's do the main mission. Du bist süß. Du auch, Jesus Christ. Meinetwegen, keine Ahnung. Äh, uh, yes. Okay. Wie sieht man Oh, 100 XP. XP. 100. Die, ich, hatte, ich hatte eine Mission mal gemacht. Ja, wo ich herumgelaufen bin und irgendwelche Schall, äh, Schall, na ja, so, Elektro-Schalldinger, Schall, Schallkästen, Stromkästen, äh, umgeflippt habe. Und davon habe ich 75 XP bekommen. Und das hat länger gedauert. Äh, was das trägt jetzt? Jo. The future, the future, the future, the future. Okay, I am stopping it. Oh, uh, hast du eine weiße Pfote? Ist das nur das Licht? Okay. Ja, wirklich easy money. Soweit ich kriege so ungefähr. 2000 Credits. Ich, 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 ich glaube, das ist gutes Geld. 2000 Credits oder 1000, aber meistens 2000, immer. Ich bin happy damit. Und ganz ehrlich, das Piep, das nervt. The Peeping, it's getting on my nerves. And why are there so many loading areas? Why can't you make it an open world like any other space game or, or cyberpunk? Ah, uh, okay. Do we have 
Bett besser ecken. Mein Gott. Weißt du, ich, ich glaube, ich könnte New Atlantis wirklich einfach... Oh, you don't say. Land Damage Cured. Oh, heiliger Boden, gesegnet sei deine Bläunis. Ja. Ähm. ja ich ich glaube, ich könnte nur Atlantis wirklich einfach nur Peking nennen. Einfach wegen der Luftverunreinigung hier. Und wegen Top Air Filters. Technology of the biggest art. Bla bla bla. Here we are. The launch. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. I oh. have messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. Thank you, Stephen. Weißt du was? Captain, Constellation will be... Gib mir deine Muni. Carrying object. Ach, obwohl ich bin nicht so gemischt, äh... Was ist Kreti noch mal gierig? Wo ist mein Anzug? Jetzt habe ich Logenschaden erhalten. Open Loading World. Ja, yeah, aber auch, aber wirklich. In diesem Spiel bin ich einfach General Grievous oder Darth Vader. Ich würde ja sagen General Grievous. Everyone will be in the library, just inside. Was ist mit If dem here, he'd probably tell you oh that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. Ja, der Boden ist durchsichtig. Wow, ich wurde gespoilert. Dankeschön. Und da ist sogar ein Teppich. Why? Und in ein anderes Sichtfilter. Okay. Anyway. We appear to have a visitor. Was ist das? Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Pirates attacked. Barrett asked me to deliver the artifact. It doesn't matter if you are. Who are you? Who are you? Why don't we start with you telling me what Constellation is? Who are you? Sarah Morgan, chair of Constellation. Oh. That means anything you discussed with Barrett <coughs> is my business. Now, if you would please answer my question. Ja, ich habe, ich wusste 70 Prozent der Zeit. I don't you start with you telling me what Constellation is. Hmm. Very well. This is a private organization dedicated to exploration. Space primarily, but also anomalies throughout the settled systems. It's inherently dangerous work, so if one of our own doesn't show up as planned, then we tend to have questions. Speaking of which, where is Barrett? Pirates attacked. Barrett asked me to deliver the artifact. I see. Bosco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Oh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and What our robot shout? to some random a employee shout? of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? Der Zunge guckt raus. Äh, es war spread, sights and music, and muted accidentally. No talking about this, everything almost killed me. Many times has this happened. Who else has had these visions? We think it's anyone else who pulls one out of the rock for the first time. Why? We're not sure yet. So if you wouldn't mind adding another data point. It was bright lights and music. 
Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, country, if you expect us to believe in fairy tales... If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Oh, Freeman, is it you? Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this oh, new yes, one to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. Nein, ich habe Lunge. Okay. That's it. Oh. Just like the others. Einfach draufgeschmissen. To imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh. Oh my god, Hexen that's it. reacting. Look at how it's coming together. Oh, you don't that say, energy that's obvious. Working between them, no manufactured material in oh. the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves Easy, that. girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, it means they're so sad. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, that's right. You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend? <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? Individually, they're just odd hunks of metal. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. As to what they are, what they're building, well, you'll be part of solving that puzzle now. And most importantly, why were they scattered? You had been constellation, what does it mean? What's expected? We're all here because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. Beyond that, you'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest of us. All right, I'm in. I mean, I, 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 I'll have to. Uh, I'm in. Tell me what happens next. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Why just some of it, our members it, aren't it. here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find oh. me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, ah. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Oh. You'll need it out in the field anyway. I found one. Just and mind your head. What do I get? 8,000 credits? Oh. Okay, missions. Level 6 soll 
ich sag mal gute Nacht und lass einen Stream mal einschlafen laufen. Viel Spaß noch und vielleicht sieht man sich bei den Kampf. Ja! Good night! Ah, ich ja, ganz ehrlich, ich bin eigentlich schon über Zeit. Eigentlich sechs Stunden das Maximum. Morgen mache ich weiter. Danke zum Hiersein. Ähm. Ja. Thank you for being here. And I guess. Why, people? What is my mission now? That's it. Okay. Ja. Gerne, gerne. Ja. Gute Nacht. I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Marco. Notable compass value, it is worthless. What, is, what, what does it do even? I mean, I cannot tell it. Okay. Okay. Library in the wall. Okay. And there's a fear. There is fear. Okay, okay. Library camera. Submarine clock. I haven't needed to go up there in a bit. Why? Oh, I just don't know how he does it. Up there all alone for so long. Some people love that kind of space. Pun intended. Who are you? Bet you never expected to end up involved in something like this. Nope, I was just mining along the way and then I just picked something up. Are you <gasps> doing okay? I'm not sure anyone really asked yet. Don't want you to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else. You matter too. You've done something really significant bringing that artifact here. I'm Mateo, theological scholar by trade, but now, well, an explorer like you. It's really good to have you with us. Okay, are you a religious member of the <laughs> Sanctum Galaxy or something? Because you have the same head. And thank you, finally someone who's, who, who who not only asks where I am, what I do, but ho but also how I am. Uh, these artifacts all came out of caves? The second one was on Kazal, buried the same as the one you found. But the first one, right under our noses for years, sitting in storage, masquerading as an oversized paperweight. What? Can you imagine potentially the greatest discovery in human history collecting dust? My wife and I have something of an understanding. Apparently, I become rather cranky when I'm not able to participate in Constellation's little adventure. My darling Lisa has concluded that it is in both of our best interests. If and I who has also seen the vision? Lodge has what do you make of the vision I saw? It. I'm not gonna lie, I really wish I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge otherwise. Both you and Barrett saw something. I don't think that's a coincidence. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but... You know, if the label fits. If it meant something I didn't understand it, well, it was something like a star map. I know it's important, I can feel it. Maybe I'm just going crazy, all I know is I've never experienced anything like it. I think this was a religious experience? I don't think so, it was something. Religious is fictional. All I know is I've never experienced anything like it. That sure lines up with everything else about these artifacts. It's all connected. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. We just need more data. Which means more artifacts. Uh, what brought you to Constellation? <laughs> well, there was some overlap in interests. I'd spent years searching for religious relics from human history. I had made a really incredible discovery, only to lose it to a greedy corporation. So I tried to steal it back. In the process, I met Walter. Turned out he owned the corporation. Oh. After a long talk, we realized we had a lot in common, and I was invited to join Constellation. That's how they 
Finance themselves, okay. Take care of yourself. Hey. Yeah. I've occasionally had my doubts about Constellation as an investment. But now, well, it's clearly money well spent. Yeah. Well, I suppose calling you a rock breaker may have been a bit out of line. Still doesn't excuse it. My frustrations lie more with Barrett. Not the first time his shenanigans have jeopardized one of our ventures. Not fair of me to take it out on you, especially since it would seem he made the right call this time. So, let's start over, shall we? Walter Stroud, CEO of Stroud Eklund, member of Constellation, and off times grumpy old man. <laughs> Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. Bye. Uh, glad to be here. Just watch the grumpiness in the future. It is free. Ha ha ha. Humor. No, why not? Yes, well, a stocked bar is a treat I think Constellation can afford. For now. But if you clean us out, you're on your <coughs> own. By the way, in addition to a place to stay, the Lodge has a wealth of modification and research equipment. Spacesuit customization. <gasps> Pharmaceutical manufacturing, <gasps> testing alien substances, <gasps> the whole thing. Oh. You can even fashion industrial pieces for large scale projects, if you don't mind extracting a few raw resources from a nearby planet, that is. I'm a fan of self reliance, so I encourage you to make use of the tools we have to build what you need. Mm -hmm. Craft what if I need him? Okay, this isn't what I expect. Find this here. Oh, what's your role in Constellation? Okay, what's your role in Constellation? Me? <laughs> Why, I'm the wallet. Someone has to fund all this, and all my success yes. in business doesn't mean much if I can't put it to good use. I don't pretend to have the daring of Ms. Morgan, or the smarts of young Mateo, but I can make sure that they have the resources they need. That's and nice. As you've now seen, those resources aren't being wasted. We're onto something big here. But we can always continue this some other time. He makes a very good and complimentary, very complimentful impression. Do you think the vision I had means anything? Up until very recently, I'd likely have dismissed <laughs> it as, I don't know hallucinations but now I'm not sure what to think I don't suppose you have a history of this sort of thing do you no. I've never seen anything like that in my life oh sure I see lights and hear music all the time it's a non-stop party in my head I haven't hit my head recently if that's what you're asking I mean have I seen something like this before this or anything else you'll have to forgive me I don't know you as well as the others here if you weren't so new to the group, I might already know the answer. Well, I have never seen anything like that in my life. Yes, I imagined as much. Barrett expressed something similar in his own unique way. I'm no scientist. I leave that to the likes of Barrett and young Noel there. But I think we can all agree there's something unusual going on here. Frankly, this is the most exciting thing that's happened in years. What kind of company is Stroud Eklund? We're most well known for ship manufacture. Oh. No expense spared. If you want the best and can afford it, you choose Stroud Eklund. Unfortunately, <coughs> our success means you'll sometimes see Stroud Eklund ship modules on less than reputable vessels. They covet them. The bastards. I've tried to convince the United Colonies we can help in that regard, but they're married to Deimos Star Yards, and those old salts are stuck in the glory days. Okay. This isn't where I would expect to find a CEO. Funny thing about companies, 
You build one sturdy enough, it doesn't need you there all the time to prop it up. Stroud Eklund functions quite well on a day-to-day -day basis, leaving me time to devote to more... esoteric pursuits. For years, I was captivated by the writings of Constellation's founder, Sebastian Banks. I finally decided to do something more than admire from a distance, and so now, I call the Lodge home, as much as anywhere else. I like him. Goodbye. Bye. 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 It's been quieter around here ever since Vladimir went to live on the eye full time. Oh, God. Vladimir. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. I don't have time for that kind of thing anymore. So much to do around <coughs> here, you know? Right, sure. You're I guess a lot overwhelming, now happen. that I think about it. I'm Noel. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. Pretty sure. Oh, so many choices? Is this really a Bethesda well, game? Uh, the vision I saw. What do you think that was? Oh, right, that. If we're approaching this rationally, I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neural input, your brain's attempt to make sense of something, an energy surge, some other phenomenon. This wasn't random synapses firing at me something. There's a reasonable explanation. Whatever I saw and heard wasn't coming from me. Barrett saw something too? He did. At the time, well, it's Barrett. We weren't sure if he was kidding around. Clearly. He wasn't. Yes, this wasn't some... This wasn't random synapses firing. It, it means something. Sure. I'm not trying to suggest otherwise. I wasn't there when it happened. I'm just thinking it through. That's okay. Now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? Uh, how long have you been working on this? Well, Constellation's been around forever, more than 50 years now. But we only became aware of the artifacts recently. Barrett discovered the first one about two years ago, right under our noses. And he was the one who got this all in motion. It's a shame he isn't here to see this. <coughs> Sarah said something about the place for me to stay with yeah, Sarah said, said something about the place for me to stay. Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Right. So you've seen the library, oh. obviously. Walter is quite proud of I the trust collection. you're still satisfied with your has made to more than a few contributions. Noel. Gardens are out the it. doors there. You could have if done you need just about anything. So it's Emphasis on the quiet. You <laughs> value At here. least usually. Well, let's head upstairs. Sebastian Banks, Constellation's founder, had this place built decades ago. It was a bit to do at the time, but most people in the city have forgotten we're here. So this is the bar, usually no tender, so help yourself, within reason, of course. Now let's see about that room. You're in luck. We were almost at max occupancy already, but there's still one room up for grabs. Thank it's still nice having the place so full.
Okay, this will be you. Common room on one side, so that'll be quiet, and Mateo on the other side, so maybe a little less quiet. I'm sure Sarah has something planned for each of us, so I'd better get back to it. Don't want to keep her waiting too long. Enjoy! Ever since I got here, this is felt like These people are family. I hope... Oh, gosh. No, I mean, that's... that's flattering. But really, we're making this up as we go. Until you arrived, we only had the two. And the vaguest sense that there was something more at work. There's still so much we don't know. And that means a lot of work ahead of us. Well, maybe there's no work at all because everything will be self-explanatory in the end. Uh, I was wondering about other types of exploration besides the artifacts. Of course. There's plenty of planets out there that no one has ever set foot on. And everything we learn about them is valuable. We have really? a board no where we post anything specific we're looking for. A type of alien flora or fauna, or a planet with a specific quality, like if it's primed to have life but doesn't yet. Okay, check out the constellation mission boards. Oh. Let me know how I can help you learn. Well, right now nothing's off the table. Metallurgical analysis, chemical composition, I'm looking at everything. One thing I'm really trying to improve is my overall database of xenobiology. I don't know if it will help in this case, but the more we know about, well, everything, the better off we are, right? Speaking of, if you're going to be out there looking for more artifacts, you're bound to come across some interesting specimens. Anything organic, I'd be happy to take it off your hands. Okay, organic okay, stuff, got it. I have help with learning. How would organic resources help with learning about the artifacts? I can't be certain that they will, but more data points are always a good thing. I don't want to rule out anything that could provide a breakthrough. And if it sweetens the deal, I can pay. Pretty well, too. Walter's pockets may not be bottomless, but they are pretty deep. Okay, I've got some organic resources for you. Anything I can learn from is a help. Window credits. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Ship inventory. Now, what do we have to sell? Okay. Stay safe, okay? So this is my room. Don't be dick. It's worthless, sadly. Plus, dick nippy. A third book. Exotic bottle. Very exotic. It's, uh, Ah, okay. I got the storage. Ah, unlimited mess. Oh. Thank you, Possessor. Uh, Chronomark watch case. Huh. Why is it so shiny? That is very good to have. Let me store some stuff. Which I will probably never use. Like weapons and set and such. No, but let's start now, why not? Um Maybe. Yeah. We 
has it already in, basically. Okay, goodbye. Nice. Okay, I need to take the stuff from my ship, which I do not need, and put it all here. I mean, like, in the top as well. Uh, I mean stuff like... Equipment, you know, which I haven't yet. Which I just don't have yet. Or well, any special weapons. What can I do here? It's a kitchen. Sure, okay, I can send which... Only five health, really. Tea. Mm. I'm so hungry. Why am I so poor? Brilliant tea, strong tea made from this. Brilliant plant. Water purified by reverse osmosis. Ready to get to work? Or was there something else? Uh, what is constellation? What do you do? We're explorers. Humanity has always hunted for knowledge in the unknown. We just take that a little more seriously than others. We were founded decades ago by a man named Sebastian Banks. He wanted a small group of people from all corners of the settled systems dedicated to the biggest question of all. What's out there? These artifacts could be everything we've been looking for. Another great secret the universe is asking us to unravel. Okay, how well known is Constellation? I don't know what you've heard, but I can imagine. First of all, I think you can dismiss any stories about us no longer existing. Hmm? I don't yeah, believe in smearing our name everywhere we can. Exploring the universe, charting the unknown, that's what counts. Besides, having a little mystery gives us room to maneuver. A fixed reputation could fence us in a lot of ways. What do you know about the artifacts? Not much, but you've seen them for yourself. It doesn't take a lot to realize we're dealing with something extraordinary. Just what that is, we'll have to figure out. It's what we do. I guess I'm ready. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Okay... The UC Vanguard? A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of United Colonies' space. They're always looking for recruits. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part-timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. Other people have artifacts? We have to assume that we're not the only ones to have stumbled into this mystery. But most people aren't going into space looking for the unknown. They're looking for places to settle, resources to extract, territory to defend. An odd-looking rock or a single strange hunk of metal wouldn't mean much to them. That's why Constellation exists, in a way. To put pieces like this together. Mm -hmm. I have to admit, I am excited. My first mission 
felt the same way when I started, too. There's an electricity in the air when you know you're about to uncover something. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. Maybe look if you follow over if you continue. So is it woods? Now continue. Is there something I want to do my own first? I get out of this anyway. Constellation have a salary? You mean besides the ship, the robot, and a place to stay all rent free? We do have some funds we can disperse from time to time. Not to mention, I think we can get you a proper suit. We're explorers. We keep a lot of equipment on hand for that purpose. So the more you work with us, the more we can share what we have. Okay. Actually, there are some things I want to do on my own first. Go ahead. Yes. Just don't take too long or my contact's information might go bad. Is it happen? Oh. Question, it's safe. Can I f can I travel freely along the galaxy now? I am at your service, Captain. Are you? Captain, now that you are a member of Constellation, I am at your service. No additional protocols necessary. Also, given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space. It might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field research. But isn't this ship enough? But you see on my Kova squad with development, what do you mean? The exploration of an unknown planet can be a major undertaking. By building an outpost, you will be able to construct scanning equipment, resource extractors, and defenses. It is even possible to set up multiple outposts capable of manufacturing, allowing you to build advanced equipment. Hmm, what kind of advanced structures could I build? The scan booster is the most obvious as it will enable you to detect landmarks and other points of interest from further away. Beyond that, extractors will allow you to collect raw materials of various types, while fabricators enable the manufacturing. A particularly prosperous outpost may even warrant the construction of cargo links, allowing you to share resources between other outposts you have built. Mm -hmm. How do I know if a planet has the resources I a planetary scan will reveal the presence of key inorganic resources, although rarer elements will be harder to find without training. And while a scan may detect the presence of life on a planet, you will have to analyze the native plants and animals yourself to know what compounds they produce. Not useful, I'll try it. Next time I touch down on a planet. The blueprints you need to construct an outpost should already be on your watch. Oh. It will automatically connect to any available materials for construction in your ship's cargo. <laughs> Do you miss Barrett? My primary function has been to support and protect Barrett during his travels. I am currently unable to do so. That is as capable as I can be of missing anyone. I believe Barrett would find your question amusing. I'm glad you take your job seriously. Protecting Barrett must have been quite the challenge. Now your job is to protect me. Yeah. Barrett has thus far survived every mission on which we have embarked. It is therefore evident that my efforts have been successful. I suspect that Barrett would disagree with how necessary my intervention has been in any given situation. Okay, how long 
have you been a part of Constellation? I arrived along with many material goods purchased by the group's previous chair, Malcolm Livingstone. Despite several significant system replacements and upgrades, I have been online for 43 years. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Like I said, uh, let's see, can I? Event in Altair. Event 
its extinction event in the Altair system. Sounds dangerous. It primed for life in Procyon A. Uh, to the gate event is primed for life in the Procyon A system. Okay. Turbe Karinai, 3B and Karinai. Oh, only a thousand.
Okay, I, I thought I can just install, reinstall the mod, you know? And let's take a look at my inventory. Maybe I have something. Where's this blues? Wait a second, I'll have to go for a second again. I got the guest again. Hi. All is good. I am here. Don't worry. Don't be afraid. Yeah, I should talk in English. You know. Move, move, move. Nein, nein, nein. Vorsicht, Vorsicht. Hey, Vorsicht. Hey. Okay, all is good. Don't worry. Everything is fine. Now, we have to end the stream for today because it is being. It is getting late, you know? Now, inventory. Did we get new items? Aha, uh -huh, okay. I guess you cannot get... Okay. Well, I guess... I don't know, it's kinda meh. Should I Google? No, but let's Google, maybe. Just to be sure. Uh... Starfield. Starfield. Do we get weapon mods as items like in Fallout 4? Starfield Star Wars mods? But no. No, weapon mods. Let's say weapon modifications, not mods. Modifications. I'm not with the weapon workbench. I can imagine I want to put it in this place. Which before you need to be used to build bots. Okay. Build Blah 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 The crucial items that you can add to your base weapon instead of being separate items that you keep in your inventory. Most other components such as the muscle blah 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 Crafted as a big component blah 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 by skills for your character to access this project. Aha! Choosing the most important skill when you are still possess a level above it the tree to even make it accessible. To complete research you will also need to contribute specific resources as research materials. So weapon mods. To craft a weapon mod with the blah 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 the weapon must be displayed as much before you need specific mods. These will be made from natural materials like rocks and specific materials like polymer as he is a solvent and lubricant. If you like the environment, you can use the solvent. This will be great out. Mind that anything in your ship's cargo hold will be available as a resource at any workbench, but you will not be able to access storage from other containers or from your companion's inventory. Yeah, 
have you have a tips and tricks that should have been delivered along the way as you craft in the Soviet mods. I think no more than crafting like it. While returning the gun to a Soviet state for modding, Finland and Kansas craft a mod for the purpose of leveling the weapon which is skill. Like this mod to craft and the bands of Finland and Kansas to the I bought a gun from enemies and choose a common of the Soviet to look through those mods as a good way to level up. I also have the three things that calibrated, while a lot of guns were calibrated like modified or bashing. In case that they have said much attached, there are some in case that the weapon is showing the best damage. I should check the player on the screen. Hmm. Uh, that's the one that's the weapon. Can you go out and check it? This is the spam map. This is the spam map shows the map of the player. Help you to know where to land, so I guess it's uh, okay, so apparently you cannot keep mods as items. That was I mean. Uh, that mods are crafted by items that you can add to your base weapon with the three separate items that you keep in your inventory. Okay. I guess it's tell every weapon. Or want. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Schade. Maybe it's in the ship, I don't know. But okay. First you have to do some research. Okay, now, uh, first of all, I don't under really understand why, because it does, I mean, I don't think it makes sense. Okay, um,
this. The sudden development.
Wait, I don't need that, I can just... Ah, yes. 
Schrott. Ich 
But okay, the orchard merchant. I love you, said the orchard merchant, and I love you, my dear, said Vincenza in return. But our passion, how long can it last? For our families will never approve of our union. Perhaps not, my dearest Vincenza. Uh, Vincenza, perhaps not, he said, pushing an orchard into her lovely big hair. But we don't need them anyway. The orchard merchant, written by Carolita Karen, published in 2325, become one of the fastest selling romance novels in the title system's history. Hmm. Yeah, it's okay. Potato, potato! Kartoshka! Hey! Oh, wow! Step again. The origin of species. Chapter 1. Variation under domestication. Included as a rather comprehensible list of varieties of species. When we look to the individuals of the same variety or sub-variety of our older cultivated plants and animals, one of the first points which strikes us is that they generally differ much more from each other than do the individuals of any one species or variety in the state of nature. When we reflect on the vast diversity of the plants and animals which have been cultivated and which have varied during all ages and the most different climates and treatment, I think we are driven to conclude that this greater variability simply due to our domestic productions having been raised under conditions of life not so uniform as and somewhat different from those to which the parent species have been exposed under nature. Darwin's theory on the origin of species on Earth continues through 14 full chapters ranging from biology to geography and everything in between. This is a Smackta outpost. I'm gonna show. Okay. Oh. Interesting. Many spaces. Oh. Okay. It closed by itself. Ah, that's a place. Is this the living area of those people who lived here? Uh, uh, uh. Godless Universe Part 3 Reactive Gauk. I expect it, but okay. Um, anything else? Chicken Tikka! Story of the Heavens. If you want to read, feel free to read. Okay, okay. Oliver Twist. Chapter 1 Treats of the Place where Oliver Twist has, was born and of the circumstances attending his birth. Among other public buildings in a certain town, which for many reasons it will be prudent to refrain from mentioning, and to which I will assign no fictitious name, there is one anciently 
common to most towns, great or small, to wit a workhouse, and in this workhouse was born on a day and date which I need not trouble myself to repeat, inasmuch as it can be of no possible consequence to the reader. At this stage of the business at all events, the item of mortality, mortality whose name is prefixed to the head of this chapter. The subsequent chapters of Charles Dickens' novel trace Oliver Twist's journey from parish boy to a street thief to happy hire and adopted son. Ah, it is the awesome toilet. Uh -huh. Uh, yeah. uh, please knock. Day since last accident. Ah, there you pass. Ah, ha. It, it. Ah, time was back. Tell it. Who are you? Who are you? Kuchi, 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 kuchi. Kuchi, 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 kuchi. Uh, probably the local pet or something. Uh, what do we have? Uh, ah, yes, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Beep, beep, beep. Nada. Huh? Did you pick? They abandoned us. Consolidated mining abandoned us. Apparently, the installation wasn't profitable enough. I should have listened to Cory. These mega corps have no humanity. It's almost, it's always money first. What a bunch of assholes. We haven't heard anything from them since they have cut us off, and we are about to run out of supplies. On top of that, we don't have a ship who can't let us. That we don't have a ship who can't let us go home. I tried to craft an emitter to send a SOS to a passing ship. If this doesn't work, we Shredded. Wow. Ich was a little.
Okay, so that's it. Add tough soap. Nothing more.